time we left off was you got a um a spy mission. That's correct. You got some sort of infiltration mission that you need to retrieve the inf uh the entirety of a very rich person's a man's arm of his omni tool. Arm. You're d I'm not letting you take the whole arm. Um the to be, to be specific, he means the Omni tool, not you don't have to get the physical thing. <laughs> you don't get have to Metal Gear Solid him? I don't know what that means. Never mind. Um. Yeah. Yes, and uh, his name was Aphiris Karagna. I, ho uh, I, I believe I sent you a picture of that. Yes, you, you did. It's pretty cool. Yes. He looks and like a bro. He, yeah. We need to get him on our party. Because yeah. I just want to... You just... Um, no, I don't think that's a good idea at all. I mean, look at him. He totally doesn't need an arm. <laughs> what? Because he's already so I, mad fucking ripped? Yeah. I thought you were going to say rich. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, when you're that rich, you don't need arms. That is true. <laughs> yeah, um... Math fact. So yeah, currently you are in the um, in the current apartment, the very nice little apartment you have. Uh, I've gotten. Yep. Okay, so if I remember shit. rightly, yeah, Crunk, Crunk wasn't coming. We were bringing Thomas to pretend to be a bodyguard. Yeah. Uh, Greg is coming as a fancy Spanish man. Whatever. Uh, I, 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 yeah, I, I, I believe. I, I believe I sent you your name. You gave me a name. It. I don't remember what it was. Uh, I'm gonna scroll up until was... I see it. I'm playing with fire in my room. I don't know if it's a good idea, but I've been doing it the whole day. Let's have a look. Ah, oh yeah, I... Quintino Rosanna. Quintino Rosanna, and uh, then I'm it... Marietta Cassi. Yes. Which sounds unsettlingly like a Russian name. Yes, you're what? Russian. He's Italian or Spanish. Wait, wait what is a Russian name? The Tagasi. Nidia Tagasi, not the Kaz Tagasi, maybe, but Nidia. No. If you say it in a Russian accent, it sounds Russian. Like, <laughs> if you say anything in a Russian accent, it sounds Russian. No, it's yeah, like I mean, even Vladimir sounds Russian no, enough. No, it doesn't you sound fuck. Russian if you say like a Daniel. It's like no. Quintino Rosanna. That, that, that just sounds dumb. Like, that just sounds dumb. It's that like, oh yeah, sorry. I'll hook you up with some deer today. It works. I won't give you a crack. And it's, kill you with the most. it's almost as though saying something in an accent makes it sound like you're saying something in no. that accent. No, it's almost no, as though saying something in an accent means. makes it sound racist as fuck. Oh <laughs> 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 well, yeah, okay, so that, 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 To be fair, we should be careful about being Rus racist towards you Russians should be really right careful now. about being Russian though, fuck. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Jesus. Whew. Dodged a bullet right there. Dodged right? that one. It's dangerous. Nice. Guys, we have people in our class that are openly racist to Russians, and we have Russians in our class. Everybody's fine with it. Especially the Russians. Fuck those guys, though. <laughs> they don't even give a <laughs> shit. It's because they're Russian. That's why nobody likes them. They should see, try giving the a is, shit. Guys, hey. See, the thing is, guys, we're not going to be not racist against Russians because Dan We don't here. give a fuck. No, because we've all played Dota. <laughs> play Dota, Dan I I openly asked the Russians, why do you play on European servers? The queues are better. Yeah. There you go. Oh, shit. No, they, like, you can't even escape them in America and Korea. <laughs> Not even kidding. Yeah. I know people who went to a European server because they kept ending up with Russians and Brazilians in their game. Yeah. And they're playing in US, East and West. Yeah, they, they just join all of them. They just click everything on the world server. Yeah, I guess so. so. yeah, there we go. That That is a right. mystery solved, sort yes. of. So I guess our Aquarium Princesses, we're going to be escorting them. You can have the short one. <laughs> I'll have the other one on my arm. Sure. Oh, and I'll have yes. a toaster with me. Yeah. Feel better. <laughs> Drake has yet to build you your love bot. Oh, don't don't describe it as a love bot, really. That makes it a little bit. I tried to build bit, them a, a love bot, out. but you told me I couldn't. God, why are you? Hey, why do you hate? Why are you made of hatred? Well, strictly speaking, I I said I'd build a tiny 
spider bot. But that could be his love bot. Wait, you're gonna put a robotic owner hole in it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All we really need to do is interface, and I mean that we can do that through a wire. Do you spend too much time getting interfaces already? Thank you. In fact, last time I believe you hung off of one while it got ripped out by a gun. And then I turned it into smithereens. Moving on to the party! Yes, okay, so uh, where's the party located? Um, it is in a tower further into the Presidium. Um, oh. it, does, it does not seem to be like the, 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 the council tower and stuff like that, but it's actually right next to it. Mm, la dee da. Very swish. Okay, it's... so. It's super like expensive. Well, luxuries. can you can, like even as you walk up, you can hear the classical music and the guys with the with with, with you know long beaked nose butlers. Oh uh, <laughs> yes, yeah. very good, very good, sir. Very good, sir. Mm, what was? Won't you care for some wine? Mm, not today, sir. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, Jeeves. I would love a drink. Please just pass it and then pour it over my genitals. <laughs> I'm trying to stay sober this evening. <laughs> of course, sir. <laughs> <laughs> right away, sir. I'm not sure. Oh, the the usual, the what head. the fuck? I'm not, not sure usual, your perception then, of rich people is accurate. Maybe this is why I'm so poor. <laughs> <laughs> you keep bit, pouring sir. wine over your genitals. Yes. That's not how you stay sober. You stay sober by just not drinking. You is it not drinking? <laughs> okay. Right. So, yeah. Okay. So I walk up to the entrance. You know, uh, I, as, assuming that she allows it, I, ha I have the lady companion on my arm. Uh, he asks for your, um, like, uh, for your name. Uh, and, my name uh, is Neria Tagasi. Like, hmm, Neria Tagasi is like very up class and stuff like that. Like, mm. okay. <laughs> yes, yeah. I know. Business has been quite good. Yes. Uh, and he looks through. There's a, he has a little panel there by the door. There are guards there, but they don't have guns or anything like that. They seem to have like very um, uh, archaic weapons, like a spear or something like, like very elegant stuff. So it's fancy, no? It's very <laughs> fancy. There's nothing. Also, in it. this is a bionic place, so they're not gonna kill us with weapons. <laughs> they have psychic. Who powers. senses anyone is gonna try to kill you? It's a party. Yeah, I was like, look, you don't. They're not actually. They're not hoping you literally die of laughter. Although, yes, I do have that power. <laughs> they don't need to um, know I don't have that power. <laughs> Charisma roll. Nailed it. Right. Um, <laughs> Charisma roll. He kills them with laughter. looks through the panel. Yeah. And uh, he looks at the others. And uh, he seems to... Ah, oh, this must be Quintino, yes? He looks at Craig. Yes. <laughs> oh wow! Yeah. <laughs> Has to instantly roll a bluff check for that accent. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm not good at yes. Make yeah. a bluff check. <laughs> no, no accent. No, fuck you. <laughs> just make it. I want to see what happens. Uh, why would a uh, sorry? Uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna lose already. I want to see what happens. I don't care. Why would a sorry and happen? He doesn't believe that's my accent. <laughs> Do you know why? Because I rolled a one. <laughs> Oh. Because Turians can't be Italian. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the Haven't Stuckey you heard that? He's a he's a he's a Turian. He's a he's a Turian. <laughs> it he says it and 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 the guard looks a bit like he put he his eyes become bigger and he's like, excuse me. <laughs> uh, yeah, and, that's me. And, <laughs> I'm, I'm and, sorry, Quintino has a cold. <laughs> and. And, and, and Errol goes. Uh, he he thinks he's an he's an Italian. Italian. He's just joking. <laughs> he's just joking. He's just joking. And then I, I indicate the lady on my arm. This is the princess Reina Ara. She like bows. Yeah. Um. And, and this one is Errol Aras. And he goes. Hmm. Yes. And this must be D L K. Am I that's, correct? That's Did correct. Boop, is... Fuck the police! No, he doesn't say that. <laughs> I, 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 I say I'm I'm sorry. I was using him. He, I must remind you that swearing is is much. It's it's frowned upon here at the I apologize. I was using him to view um movies, and there's must have something must have gotten scrambled up. Uh, it won't happen again. Great human history channel. Beep beep. <laughs> 
I apologize. If it happens again, I will make sure he is rebooted. And then I walk on inside. Most excellent. Yes, the door flashes open, and uh, you go into a pretty big elevator. There's no one in there. And, um... <laughs> the elevator opens up like, Oh, fuck, let's get your clothes off, I'm tired. This <laughs> life stuff is hard work. And, uh... It swooshes up. Cool. It goes really fast. So you can... And, and you even have, like, a, a view. Whoa! No, it doesn't go fast. It takes about ten fucking years. <laughs> I know how elevators in Mass Effect work. Yeah, you no. know, they last exactly as long as it takes for the loading zone. Well, yeah, in Mass, in Mass Effect 1... In the other games, there's a loading screen. <laughs> Unless you break the game and move all loading screens, like I. Yeah. Th then they take no time. So great. Yeah. There's no loading. <laughs> um. Yes. You get to the f uh, to the top level. Uh, it seems to be like uh, literally, like it seems to be like a glass house above. Or on the roof, so it's, it's like a dome. Kind, kind of, yeah. It's it's very stylish. It's like very, not not a lot of corners, you know. Like it's not like a, you know, a, uh, what's it called? Like a square glass house it's, or it's anything like, a, it's like that. It's not like a foyer. Hmm? It's not like a big foyer then. It's sort of like a big open. Do not wall. know what that word means. Uh, they're like you know those when when you walk into a mansion, it's like the landing floor before the stairs and all that fancy stuff. That's called the foyer. I'm yeah. F F O Y E R. Foyer. I know it's really weird. It's because it's. I wrote it as foyer. Like. Foyer. No, nowhere in that word you can hear an R. I know, but it's foyer. 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 Uh, but, but, fa fancy that... people do pronounce it foyer. Ah, now that so, makes. Foyer is. No, you mean ignorant people pronounce it foyer because they <laughs> they learned it I'm from. Looking at some pictures here and they seem to be of stairs yeah yeah it's usually usually there they're is that big opening the yeah yeah ah okay so it's yeah yeah, yeah. it's, it's the thing pretty you much like that. It's a also big... known as entrance hall yeah yes for us common hall. folk you bloody commoners <laughs> i bet your blood isn't even blue <laughs> of course, it's... get it? I'm in a sari, you see. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. I don't oh, even know. Come on, man, that glorious. Write that down, James. <laughs> I said, Reyna, remember that one for me so I can regale my friends with it. <laughs> we are all your friends and we hated it. <laughs> Reyna, um, I... They might be correct. <laughs> uh, in fact, I checked, like, how's she, how's she doing then with this crowd? Uh, who? How's Reyna doing with the, uh... Re uh, Reyna? Yeah. Like, how, how's she coping with amongst the socialites? Because she always struck me as the thuggery one. Yeah, she, she she's alright. Like, she she seems to be very, like, elegant when I actually get, gets to it kind of thing. Uh, Errol seems to be more, like, a little bit nervous, but then again, she's also and know, been, learned, been learning from her sister <laughs> kind of thing. Neat, neat. Um, no, I, 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 look, I look impressed. I give they seem like, used oh, to, yeah. like, crowds and stuff like that. Neat. Well, they're fucking princesses, so no fucking wonder. <laughs> they don't exactly act very princessy, so I'm delightfully surprised that they're not fucking anything up. <laughs> I don't mean it in the nicest of ways, but I'm. No, there, there's it. there's not a lot of commotion or anything. Like, oh my god, it's the princesses! No, uh, uh, it's they're not like complete like uh, the, what's it called celebrities or something like that. Yeah. Okay. But they are royalties, and um. They are recognized, of course, but um, as you get into the entrance hall, uh, you can see the foyer or whatever, the, 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 the like the curved stairs up, and like it's yep, very yep. it's very open, and you can see a lot of people mingling and of all mm. races. You can even see like uh, uh, an Elcor like in the middle of everything, and he looks very classy. And... <laughs> oh, it's got a bow tie. <laughs> Oh, four in a top hat and a bow tie. You can hear like a small hum from from, from over there because he, he can hear that he's talking. <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, it's just like that reverberation from all the yeah. way there. They're like, oh, there's definitely an Elcor talking somewhere within within a mile. Um, 
Oh, uh, uh, okay, do any of them look like they're particularly do, like? Do I recognize any rich businessmen? I mean, I I have all that kind of streety knowledge, so do I notice anyone that's? I'm like, oh shit, that's that rich entrepreneur one. Oh, wow, Thomas. <laughs> <laughs> um, you can see that there is a council member there. Um, the yeah, sorry woman that you can that I hope you get to play the games is the is the woman from the first game. Oh neat. I resist every urge to go up and flow with her. I fight that urge. <laughs> um, Especially since I have the lady on my arm. Probably really bad form. Yes, yeah, it's actually. a bad idea. <laughs> Pretty bad uh, form. <laughs> I show incredible restraint. <laughs> um further ahead you um or you go in further, and you can see in like uh, you can see the tables being filled with food and like all sorts of uh, uh, refreshments and alcohol. Um, Ray, <laughs> <laughs> like you see me salivate slightly and fight it back. Like, yes, yeah. uh, you can Must see like spy. see like a small bar on the uh, and on the on one side you can see uh, on the. Uh, on the far end, you can see the balcony. It's a very big balcony. Uh, it has like tables with uh, small chairs by it. And it almost looks like a little cafe out there, but uh, like everything here is is the same thing kind of thing. All right, cool. And um, uh, pretty much in the middle of everything, you can see uh, a statue. Uh, it is a statue of a Krogan. Ooh. What? <laughs> Zero uh, surprise. Oh, I and, thought it would be a uh, nice statue. In front, of it, in front of it, you can see a very tall old Turian standing and talking with people. Oh, Would it okay. happen uh, to be the Turian we're looking target for? Identified. Uh, <laughs> target identified. You just yell at target identified as a red laser okay, goes okay, on. Okay, like, and, and then when everyone looks, I turn them and go, why, yes, that is the snack table. Could you please be a deer and fetch something for us to eat? Affirmative. <laughs> yeah, i like, oh, <laughs> 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 Say that to uh, it's just like I have to keep my entire job just gonna be covering up for Thomas. <laughs> you know, um, I suggest we don't just like jump straight to the old man as to you know we work our way up. So I'm just gonna look for the richest ones to go and talk to, especially since I guess I might as well try and do some business for those Quarry and Geth. You know, drum up some interest. What was the pl What was the allegiance called? All right, Hastrum Allegiance. Yeah. Fuck it, it's the allegiance now. <laughs> yeah, but well, we know what we mean when we say the allegiance, so I guess that works. Yeah, the allegiance is the Aesir allegiance, kind of. Yeah. Yeah. Good. <laughs> yes. Um. Yeah, there's just a lot, a lot of people right now, and I suppose. Wait, are, are you like separating or anything like that? Are you like going? Well, I separated to get the snacks. Probably. Yeah, I had him go get snacks. So. Um. What about, what about you? Are you going to stick along or not, Greg? I mean, Quintino. Uh, <laughs> Quintino. I don't know. Oh, the call is yours. Do you want to try and schmooze, or would you like to join me for trying to make some business? Um, I will join you at first, and then perhaps I will find someone else to converse with. That's um to okay. give a little more space um in perspective. To the right, you can see a, a pool, Ooh, a like pool. a swimming pool. Cannonball. Um, um, and to the left, you can see it leads into a room of antiques and um, like paintings and stuff like that. Ooh, antiques and paintings. Mm. I return with the snacks. Oh, awesome! I uh, I I select a couple out that look particularly delicious. I nod my thanks. Indeed. I stand there with a platter covered with food. Um, <clears throat> a very well. Uh, a very well dressed um, uh, tur Turian with a plate on his hand and like a towel above uh, across his arm, just going and stuff, and says, "Would you care for a drink?" And he holds up the uh, the the plate with the drink for each and one, every one of you. Why, except yes. Thomas. <laughs> I apologize. Go. I'm sorry. I don't really drink very often. I do. Uh, I'll uh, have his. Bluff <laughs> <Love Yeah>. check. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm safe. I hold back. Yeah, I don't. Drink. 
It's like a physical effort for me to do that, man. I yes. hope you appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I, yes. I, I, I turned down the drink. Yes. Um, I if I remember rightly that when you, when a character gets drunk in, in like tabletops and stuff, they get plus two charisma and it's minus two dex and plus two strength. <laughs> That's the trade off. So actually, no, it's like I, I, get, I go, although I suppose one won't hurt. I, I suppose. Like, yes. The tide although is I, my I, 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 I apologize. Please don't let me drink too much. I might get a little bit lightheaded. Then you'll get minus. <laughs> yeah. uh. like, I just drink and go, God, I miss Red Carl. <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, so Grey takes a drink, you all have a little drink, and uh, you... Just uh, a lot I, of I, like... I'm gonna try and... Uh, do I recognize poisons? <laughs> Take a sip. Just gonna check. Doesn't have to be a little bit paranoid. Uh... Why would anyone poison us? That's exactly why I'm paranoid. Because <laughs> it's crazy. No. It makes no sense. <laughs> um, Don't ask, it's just how I... You take... 50 constitution damage, you die! That's unfortunate. No. Do I not get a fortitude save at least? <laughs> it's a DC 68, but if you crit, I guess it's an automatic success, so. <laughs> well! Damn no. <laughs> you will die. You'll die. My critical fail, I become. Thomas a... will be the one who completes the quest. Oh. Hand over your arm! Your face belong to me, right? <laughs> Can I look at that Omni tool? Thank um, you. They just walk off with it. I don't suppose there is any real uh, check for just checking if you can like taste the poison or like identify. Investigate. It, it would be um, inve no. Yeah. Investigate is more like um, that's, that's pulling some. It's, um, it's more like uh, detective. Oh, kind of yeah, some Sherlock Holmesy type bullshit. Is investigate. Yeah. I guess that kind of. It would be no It would be knowledge and nature, but I don't have that. So yeah, just, just I guess it's, oh wait no I have I have the ability to tolerate poison it's a skill that I actually even have leveled up because I'm a battle mine one sec this. so at the very least I have tolerated poison to a twenty so I think I'm even if there was poison I tolerated the shit out of it tolerate you don't get drunk yeah I know it's like it's like it doesn't even say it's like you know resist it's like no tolerate is it man this poison is kind of unpleasant but I yeah, guess it's it, real. On the bottle just stands so like. It's not working. <laughs> the butler's like, he should be getting the squits right about now. <laughs> I have drank like, rank all bitch. I would like that more. No, I just like, did I tell you about the time I tried rank? <laughs> <laughs> and he's just like, fuck. Plan B, plan B. <laughs> plan B. Gun! Oh, <laughs> yes, Get him! <laughs> right. Uh, um, you cannot taste any poison. Right. And um, it's, it's very delicious. Oh, very nice. I yeah. ask if there are any suitable for Aquarian friends. Uh, yeah. Uh, the the two other glasses are indeed for they got Aquarians. So he's Yay. very much prepared. He is a butler. <laughs> you know. I I, I got a confirmation. Good job, my good man. And then I slip him a couple credits. He 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 doesn't like he as any butler would do. He just kind of has no expression. And just oh, my deepest gratitudes. <laughs> Yeah, I know. It's like, and then secretly, when when he thinks no one's looking, he's gonna fist pump. Yes, <laughs> yes, like I did it. I did it. <laughs> I did like, it, jumps, Mom. I'm don't jumps, make you proud, brother. Jumps up and like puts fist his pump. fucking heels the heels back together. He's like, <laughs> <laughs> time to go home to Kansas. <laughs> <laughs> time to go gambling. <laughs> no, please <laughs> like home. I'm off to go on go <laughs> fuck bitches. I'm done with the Presidium. This is bullshit. <laughs> I just think right. you know, it, like you know, all rich types like to flash a little bit of cash, even for the hired help. You know, you yeah. want to make a couple of smiles happen. He doesn't, he doesn't turn it down. <laughs> of course. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to look for any rich old businessmen, and I start to talk about, you know, I bring up the Hastrum Alliance, and say that I've recently been making some investments in them myself, and it's been going quite nicely. They've become quite a technological forefront. I stand there next to him, looking slightly intimidating. You look, you stand there next to him, looking slightly like a technological achievement. <laughs> as long as I don't open my mouth. Yeah, no. Well, sure, whatever. She just go. Open I am proof. Proof has been. There you go. Proof. They insisted um, on trying to get my friend here reformatted, but I've kind of grown used to his quirks. <laughs> um. Let us see. Just gonna get this fucking corporations pages up up again so I can know oh, the right, names. Alright, see the businesses. Yeah, <clears throat> it's really difficult to keep all these names. Um. All right, so 
you are now the the people you are talking to are is a Turian, an Asari, and a Volus. Oh, fantastic! Especially, yes. I'm, I'm going to pay special attention to Volus because they're the crafty business ones. Yes. Um. So they wear adorable little suits. <laughs> they're like pot. They're like pot belly pigs. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm making fun of her. <laughs> the Volus. <laughs> not like actually saying no. I'm not saying it. Uh, um, Snoopy. The Volus. The Volus stays. Hmm. Um, the guess and Corian. <laughs> I can't. I can't, don't laugh. I can't do it, man. You can do it. <laughs> I can't do it <laughs> anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually the boss going. I can't live this charade. I am not rich. I want. I am not even a lips. <laughs> It's a Solari in a suit. And then he just... God damn it! <laughs> right. He jumps out the window. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> it's the cops! <laughs> um... Alright, he, um... Presents himself as, um... As the spokesman for Apex Omni Tools. I look at um, like and go, Oh, Apex! I'm so fond of your models! Yeah, he, he like thanks you for it. And uh, it, by the way, Epic's Omni Tools is not only Omni Tools; it's like electronics overall, so it's computers and all kinds of stuff. <laughs> I like uh, I direct him to my nerds. <laughs> I got yeah, these two just, here with yeah. They, 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 they just nod. It goes yeah. We know this guy. <laughs> um, I, I I do actually have reputation, you know. Yeah, yeah you I, do have yeah. reputation. Yeah. Um, but they don't, we don't have reputation as range, those people, so don't. Sure. <laughs> we don't. We don't have the right reputation for this place, Shut let's up, put please. it that way. Yeah, however, right now you have different identities. So what reputations you do those identities have? Or are they just, you know, fake big names? Hmm? Do, they, do, our, do our identities have reputations, or are they literally fake identities with rich people? They are literally fake identities. Okay, cool. They, see, they are literally um, put as a, uh, like, a spy. Think of it as a smoke screen above the actual uh, uh, representatives. Like you okay. are, and and they believe that you are the new uh, representatives, while there are others already. I see. So, okay, then that's fantastic. Yep, that works for me. Yeah. So, um, he questions like, uh, what about the Captain Corians? Like, sure, they have. Um, like and sure they have like technology and stuff like that, but um, how would that uh, like be benefit the rest of the of the citadel if 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 they actually supported the the Gorian, Corian and the Geth and why not the uh, you know the Corian fleet? Well, it's been kind of a hard journey. I'm sure you're aware that you know it's not exactly been anything less than hostile until quite recently between the two factions. It's been quite a step going forwards. He mentioned uh, actually the Turian mentions that the Corians are a, a, he like he he says them you know I've heard that the, um, the Corian fleet are actually mounting an attack now I don't know if this is true but could this mean that there could be a war between the Corian and Geth um, cults or cooperation or whatever they call it and the other Corians. I I I shrug and laugh. He like off. looks around at people and goes like, hmm, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> uh, I I laugh the fact off and go, sir. I'm afraid you must be misinformed. You see, the representatives for the Haystrom Alliance, which is the name that they actually go by, uh, you know, they are quite noticeable amongst the fleet's members themselves. Although there may still be disagreements amongst them, the Quarians would never fight their own, even if they're alongside the Geth. The proof is on my arm right here next to me. May I present? One of the princesses of the Corians, Rena are. Oh yes, they they bow and they go, and uh, <laughs> the Turian, A.K.A. served. <laughs> I'm just thinking through everything you just said. Now it was a mouthful. Thank um, you. I'm proud of myself. I am. That's why I'm not gonna let you roll on that because that was very well put. Thank you. Um. The, the Turian, like, uh, 
like continues his argument like um like he doesn't really seem convinced he still brings up the argument that but the geth are like um i can he he says that he i can clearly see that geth can be friendly as he like nods at at uh, at thomas and that that they can be reasonable but uh well. the current the current the current uh Ikorian fleet um might not uh, agree it is, true, after all, their sense. own creations, and it's very difficult to say what what they should do with their own creations. The haste uh, allegiance is much more profitable. For whom, he says. For outsiders. Corian fleet, do not trade, just scavenge. <laughs> I look across and, I, go, and I, I nod and go, you should be aware of how the Geth operate. They basically are one. If this particular Geth is in agreement with how the Orions and the Geth interact, then you can be most assured that all of them feel at least as close as they can feel, you know, similar. They agree. Um, the Vol Volus p points out that um, but the Geth has, uh, of course, attacked, um, like, council races before and Heretics. has, has Heretics. been dealt with and, and he says that has been dealt with but there are report that there are the reports uh due to Shepard's uh in and and um and, and encounters with the heretics that there are is possibilities of cat geth factions we don't how do we, tend to how do we know that this is the only geth. faction he says i look to DRK and go well I, I don't see what your actual query is. It makes no sense for there to be more Geth factions than these two offshoots. Because they're the ones that agree with the Geth mainstream, and there's the ones that don't. And they have already become one consolidated group, aka they're the heretics. Although comparing my Geth companion here to the heretics is actually quite insulting, and I try and turn it back on him. <laughs> he he gets a bit like, oh, I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> it's like a story. I mean, I didn't mean to say black people. No, it's just, <laughs> <laughs> whatever you do, you call them. Anyway, Dude, he's a fool as he needs to watch his fucking mouth. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Can't do much. He's just not like oh, big guy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I, I give I give him the look, but I let it pass with you know the smug nod. I'm like, yeah. fair enough. It's okay. Not everyone is aware of such a thing. It's. Quite a subtlety. There's obviously a lot of, um, like, as the conversation goes on, there's a lot of controversy against Geth, but um, there is less controversy than it is had than it, it has been before. Yeah. So it's like it seems to have been improved, but it still seems to be in a state of everyone's kind of like, eh, do we really want to do this? Um, um, I, just a quick question. Mm -hmm. um, is it common knowledge that, like, the reason the Geth left where they were at all was because some douchebag... The who and the Geth? The, like, the Geth left um, their, like, Geth space, whatever it's called, because of some douchebag Turian, right? Is that, like, common knowledge? One second, guys. I just because wanted a policy Turian... check. I think I need to take a photo of this with my phone, because I don't even believe this bullshit. What? Yes, it means I just created under diplomacy, by the way, and just hoping hoping you're all aware there that that's a thing that happened. <laughs> you um, don't even need to roll. I didn't great. need to roll, but I'm just make I'm just nailing this one in the coffin so we can continue on without you know great. making without say, running Rona's mouth out. Like the the reason the Geth left their space at all and you went mean in and, aspect one, yeah. Yeah. Like okay. is it common knowledge that they were led by a Turian? Um if uh, if I remember correctly, in Mass Effect One, and this is like the Mass Effect One is canon in this story, kinda. Unless I make some st sort of stupid like, like plot twist later on, I don't know. But like that's canon for now, and, uh, and we're and, just in the universe. The in, main storyline should. Well, yeah, like... but it, but in the we're actually in the storyline. You're just doing your own adventure. But whatever. In there, um, uh, it, they they do say that that um. That well, base. I'm trying to think of what they actually think about it. The the point they is they presented the fact that it was Reapers, but they thought the Reapers was a god that the Geth made up. That the god is it was just like a 
a, you know, a myth that the Geth projected to get a cause, and yeah. therefore, um, I I believe that um, people think that, that Saren was like. I believe these the, I believe the common knowledge, the, the the most popular like common knowledge. If not, it doesn't. It wasn't exactly true, but the most common knowledge is that Saren. Um, uh, projected himself as a god to the Geth, and the Geth believed in that, and therefore he pitted the Geth towards the council just to further his goals. But right. in truth, when in truth, it was a Reaper. Okay, but people know that Saren led them. Yes, okay. but the Reaper, the Reaper is very. So I much shouldn't probably be sa say that I am of Quarian design and by Turian modification. Because you, like, modified my base code. This is true. I, I just want to point out to them that although the Geth have caused problems, they were perfectly peaceful within their own world until a Turian led them to do otherwise. So, you... God damn it, Greg, you made Lame me... Lame Canada! <laughs> Lame Canada! Right, Dan, what, what did you roll? I rolled diplomacy for like just basically sealing the deal on these motherfuckers. <laughs> Did you sell the deal when you just talked to them? <laughs> That's true. But yeah, you totally crit, and yeah. I know. <laughs> My wealth bonus goes up by seven. <laughs> Yay! Oh, but they, they, they completely agree with you. They they're like, oh, the, 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 even like uh, the the uh, even like the the volus kind of kind of goes to the turn. It's like, mm, yes. Uh, well, I don't even know who who did he even work for. I need to fucking. Did I say what, who you guys were representatives? Shit! Damn it, Dan! I was you. I always thought we were just doing this off the history lines. <laughs> what now? Who are we representing? Mm -hmm. Uh, the you were. Uh, we represent the Krogan. Well, yeah, but let, 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 no, 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 no. I'm not saying that if you're representing someone else, you can't uh, do the thing with the Haystrom. Like, you can oh, right. still be, you can still be like, we have connections with the, these guys. You should join them, kind of thing. Can't One second, like, gotta quickly find a big name. <laughs> yeah, I, I have to find something like that now. So I'm just like, don't worry, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick one. <laughs> I, I looked it up and then I nearly found crime bosses. Damn it! No, can't do that. Well, I guess you could go with something like mining and energy, and just go for. Is there any Corian corporation? This I doubt it. Yeah. Uh, actually, there might be. One sec, I will look for more. Just make up your own one. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, no, there's Say some Say a name, and I'll fucking do like fuck it. The Del the Delta Pavonis Foundation. You'll have to type that. The Delta Pavonis. I couldn't. I did Delta not. Delta Pavonis. <laughs> what? Why did I select that and then it gave me the page for Demeter? What the fuck? <laughs> Give me a moment. That was no good then. I. It's called. It says Delta Pavonis Foundation, but then the hyperlink takes me to the planet. The the planet wiki for Demeter. Delta Pavonis. Del okay. Delta Pavonis. Demeter. What? How about Exogeny? It's raised by a. Exogeny. There you go. Exo Exogeny Corporation is an interstellar company specializing in planetary exploration and colonization. That sounds like exactly what I'm after. Like, literally exactly it. Exogeny. Where is that? Where is that? Exogeny. There it is. That looks about actually exactly what I'm after. Oh, ah, and yes. we've got our new portable version. Mmm. What is that? Our new portable... Uh... Temporary colonizer. Well, uh, what? Are you, not, wait, you're describing not colonizer. me? <laughs> um, I mean, I, terraformer. I, 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 you're describing a terraformer. You know my like tube thing I have that like creates an environment what I want anywhere. Are you? No. Do you still have all of this shit. <laughs> well, no, if he doesn't we, have it with him right now. If, if we are representing this company. Then that's our cover. We've brought some shit with what us to, to show off. I don't know. I don't know how these things work. Would no, you no, bring off a show? The show? We just basically say okay. we're here for these guys, and then that's like it. That's the whole story. Okay, sure. 
Right. I've never been but whatever. to a you are exogenic business meeting. Yes, we're here on behalf of the exogenic corporation. Yes. <laughs> like I literally, I looked up. I just looked. I looked through the corporates. It's like, oh, there's one for literally finding other places and colonizing and making business with upcoming planets. That's like, that's that. That's the fucking Hastrum Alliance thing that we're trying to make happen. Like that's awfully fucking convenient now, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Right. So My you were saying something in the conversation, or was it just like? Yeah, no, we've we basically, we've, we've all wrapped it up. Right, okay. So, um, yeah, they're, they keep uh, talking, but uh, you can move on if you want. Yeah, I go, oh, one second, I believe it would be time for us to uh, greet our gracious host. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that comes the tough bit. But again, we're going to all that no, rock shit over. out of their bluff. You walk over. To be fair, he's talking with, uh, with uh, the Elcor. And he uh, seems quite bored. Uh, the the, the, <laughs> like, there the and you see bored side. And this is kind see. of a thing, isn't it? Uh, he he. You can see as you step up to him that he his eyes are closed, and um, the Elcor seems to be staring at him. <laughs> and I like as, <laughs> and you're literally standing in front of them too, right now. Nothing is happening. <laughs> oh no! I, I I'm trying to think of a, like the least awkward way to say hello without being like, oh, "God, you look terribly fucking bored." Hi, my name is Rat. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. uh, Cover blown. You get ass assassinated. Damn it! I knew it. By poison. No, I I can. Uh, I guess I'll put up with it. So I guess I'll die quietly. <laughs> No, uh, I, I walk up and go, Ah, oh, you must be our gracious host. It is a pleasure to finally meet with you. I'm sorry, I'm not he, interrupting, am I? He, uh, as the first word uh, comes, comes out of your mouth, you, you can see his eyes open, and he goes, Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm sorry, I pretend. What? I just pretend not to notice. Like, I'm just going to be polite. You can see, and you can see that the... That the... And the Elcor says, Delighted, you're awake now again. Can I continue? And he goes, <laughs> Oh, I'm s terribly sorry, but uh, it seems like I'm more a guest to talk with. I apologize <laughs> and go, I am very I sorry to have interrupted you. If you want later on, I will happily converse with you. I'm interested to hear what you were talking about so delightedly. <laughs> I look to the others like, I tell them with my eyes, I'm lying, I'm gonna get the fuck out of Dodge if I can. <laughs> but like, yeah, no, I'm as nice and uh, diligent and I try and, you know, yes. help them shift off. I can't cope with, come up with an adjective right now, so the Elcor walks off. Uh, I'm contented. <laughs> yeah. That's a good Wildly plan. flatulent. <laughs> I'm not oh, sure that's an emotion. <laughs> it is if you're an Elcor. Because I'm pretty sure they have four buttholes. Whoa! <laughs> what? What? It gives him a, 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 a vast range of sub t subtones. Maybe well, that's well, how they converse. Yeah, exactly. Only it's all subtones. Only Nagasaki. <laughs> Nagasaki. All I can think of. All I can think of is this comic. Every, every time I hear an uh, uh, an, an Alcor actually talking. Hold on, I'll send you a big one. There it is. It's amazing. It was the only thing I could think about in that moment. All struck by your beauty, there's a Texaco. <laughs> it's really long. Just read it. I'll wait. I like that. <laughs> Sexually. <fine. laughs> I think you are just jealous of my pimper. <laughs> Mild rebuke. That's adorable. <laughs> it's like the corner with a massive chest. Like, ah, this guy, I like this artist's style. <laughs> That's awesome. Wow. That is great. Uh, yeah, no, uh, uh, so I guess I, I, I speak to the man and go, uh, you're welcome. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Um, I welcome you here. And he, he sounds a little bit, um, 
Like his throat is, you know, he just sounds very old. Oh, is so, it way, the, the wavery voice? It's a bit crazy. Oh, yes. I can't do it because I'm not old. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice to meet you. <laughs> I'm <Nope>. passing a stone. <laughs> not that old. <laughs> you said very old. Very old, not that old. <laughs> not time. I need a machine to breathe. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, he's not a <laughs> Okay, moving on. Okay. <laughs> a pleasure to meet you, my lord. My name is Nuria Tagasi. Uh, yes, and you are the representative of. Uh, we're representing, representing the Exogeny Corporation. We've been uh, especially pushing for one of our latest ventures in the. Uh, Hastrum Alliance, you know, the uh, Geth Quarian faction. Uh, <laughs> allegiance! <laughs> Whatever. That's been, that's been building up in the Just there. sneaking that in there. <laughs> I'm sorry, there were some discussions about the name, but they never really came to a final decision. They did. Just I, did. Believe it, I believe they are, in fact, correct, though, in that it is the uh, Hastrum Allegiance, not Alliance. My apologies. <laughs> <laughs> So I'm doing the Um. Uh, he's he very elegantly, like, uh, takes your hand and like kisses it on 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 the hand. He does the same. I I I I, I force up the blush. I'm like, oh, I'm charmed. And 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 the princesses as well. I blush um, successfully. I'm charmed as fuck. And, and he shakes hand with Craig. And um, <laughs> you kiss him on the hand, and, and he goes to shake hand with the uh, with Thomas. He okay. Takes out his arm. Boop. And, 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 he, and he like tilts his head. Is like, come on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I, I give him a nudge. It's okay. Don't be afraid. I I I, I like do do like a high five impressive like <laughs> instead of like. Shaking his hand, I just like do like clap. It. <laughs> yeah, it's like a clap. It, what is it? It's, a, it's a low five. Yeah. He like he, he like a little bit embarrassed, embarrassingly like looks down on the phone. <clears throat> that will do. <laughs> yeah, I go. I apologize. He's still not. I'm sure you're aware that Geth aren't exactly one for social situations. Usually, we've been working on this one, but it's oh, been he, quite a bit of work. Oh, he's but the t about the twentieth I've met today. <laughs> I look quite surprised to go, oh really, have you been um, speaking to members of the Allegiance? Uh, the Allegiance? The History the Allegiance. Allegiance. I, I, I look quite confused. And then I look to the Geth and go, are there any other Geth factions in the local area right now? Connecting to GethNet. Beep. <laughs> beep, beep. Do, <laughs> how many Geth do I sense? Um, you don't sense any Geth in the building. I go, are there any- Okay, I expand my range, range okay? To the okay, second- you, you can- Your range uh, equals to like, half of the Citadel, and you can see Geth, but they're like, on the street. There's like, a, like, expected numbers like, about a uh, hundred, two hundred, not a lot. They're very not- small. they're not- how many are in the Presidium? Presidium? A very small amount, like, maybe- 10 or 20. I look at him and go, when are they still in this building, this location? Hmm? I, 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 I ask our host if, like, the Geth that he spoke to are actually still in the area, because if they're not on the Geth there. And <laughs> it's like, oh no, I, I'm just fascinated with the creations is all. I go down the street sometimes and... Well, I look, I look visibly relieved because I was like, "Oh god, a heretics attack right now!" We're fucked. He said, um, I would be able to sense the I, heretics. I, I used, used to heretics. attempt, well, attempt to convert, um, make a conversation with them, and um, with varied results, of course. <laughs> yeah, I look at the Okengo. Even in day-to-day -day conversations with my bodyguard here, we still get varying results. <laughs> I'm impressed that you've had the uh, statistically endurance. all results are the same, just different questions. 
I, I, I. They are really good at math. They are <laughs> fan. I, I, I blink it. They are quite good at maths. <laughs> they talk like they did math. <laughs> Why is he Yoda? <laughs> this is He's not Yoda. I do it. Wait a second. I'm just gonna have a quick look at Matt. Matt. I don't know what check Matt that is. Sounds like they talk like. Hmm? <laughs> I, I give him a quick. I don't know what I would use as a check to be like. Is this guy? Is this guy a few cocoa puffs short of the whole bowl? <laughs> um, sense motive. Uh, quick barrel beat. Some wisdom check. So if you don't have any sense motive. Uh, let's see here. Sense motive, no. Uh, so that's just a flat sixteen. Flat sixteen. Um, Pretty you well. can just um, you can see that this person doesn't really seem to be like trying to. Uh, I, I don't know. Like he doesn't seem very. Um, Annihilate every human in the building. Word. God damn it. Um. Is he not very interested or involved or? No, he's definitely involved. Like he seems very interested in the guest, but he's he's old and he seems a bit like uh, like he forgets minded? things really quickly. He's like the typical senile. Yeah, senile. Is he Alzheimer's? He kind of. Is he Ezekiel Boots, the twenty-year-old Alzheimer's-ridden cleric of the crossbow? Like... I still remember that shit. <laughs> he just seems a bit like off. No, he doesn't see it. and like sometimes he's like really into the conversation and sometimes he's just like in another world. Uh, and, um, no, I like that. Okay. I'm gonna and, wait for one of his crazy moments and then I'm going to just ask if I can look at his awesome looking Omni tool. It's quite fantastic. <laughs> like I'm literally gonna wait until you know there's a bit of a lapse in the conversation where it looks like he's off in the zone out. What was the name of that uh, the Volus who did the Omni tool thing? What was the Omni tool group? That was uh Mm -hmm -hmm. It was Apex Omni Tools. Okay, great. Yeah. Okay. So next time he's a bit funky, I'll you know make my move. I don't know when that is though, so I presume that it doesn't take long for him to sort of have a little bit of a shift. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna describe it as a shift. But, the, but I don't even know like what sort of thing you're talking about, Mama. No, like, you know, you know when you know when his brain gets a little bit absent when he's like really on it, and then suddenly he's not quite as on it. I'm gonna wait yeah. for that little bit of a lapse in judgment. Yeah, but right, and when um, he, yeah, when he next lapses, make, I'm just like make oh. a d20 check. Okay. Just, a, just a one. Fourteen. Fourteen. You can sense that this guy is a biotic. You can sense that he's a really powerful biotic. Ah, uh, that's bad news. Okay. Um, it it feels like he, it feels like a network is connected like you can feel this right now you are a biotic and you yeah. can basically sense by not like see exactly where they are or something like that but you can sense that they are there and you can sense the that, that this guy is trying or is connecting with other people in 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 in, in the in the actual like um um locale of this of this place doesn't seem like it, like he's mind controlling anyone. Do I think but, that he's got that kind of potential? Um, with the amount of power that is radiating from him, you sense that is most likely possible. Does he know that I'm aware? Um, yes. Uh, <laughs> I give him the look like, well, I'll be damned. That's very impressive, sir. Oh, he goes, yes, yeah, not, but of course not everyone is a natural biotic. That's why we, uh, we at Bi Binary Helix will, um, that's why we as, at Binary Helix will provide uh, ample supply of biotic amps, especially our new, um, a new application that we just finished today. A new application? What would that be? Oh, just some jimbo jambo. It's, it's oh, come it's... now! You can't just leave me on tender hooks like that. <laughs> uh, oh, the presentation will be soon. Oh well, I can hardly work. wait. I, can, I go well, I can hardly wait, and I, I hope the others can tell that I'm like nervous as all shit right now. Because <laughs> 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 I'm like I'm stood next to a guy who's basically like a walking brain nuke. <laughs> I'm like, you see him, wow. Power. <laughs> yeah, God. Unlimited power. 
<laughs> you know, I'm like, I'm basically with the moment I realize, I, I basically get that that kind of nervous right now. I'm like, wow, this is this shit is real. <laughs> you might just turn my brain to pudding. Um, I, go, I go, well, I honestly can't wait. And so I, I guess I'm not going to try and make a move for the Omni tool right now because I don't want to die a horrible death. <laughs> um... Is there anyone, like, while, while he's still in the vicinity, is there anyone, like, directly nearby that I think that he would be able to, you know, make into a sudden threat, like, you know, armed security or something like that? He could suddenly be like, you, there you're now a soldier, shoot that guy! There are no armed, like, actual, like, weapons every, any, anywhere that you can see in plain sight. You can see guards, but they are, like, they see more, um, it's almost more like their decoration than actual, like, practicality. Oh. They're not very functionary then, they're just... They, 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 they definitely do seem like they know their shit, but they don't seem like it's more of a... They don't seem like they're expecting to fight. No. But they're ready for it. They're ready for it. Alright then. Okay, yeah, I, I, I let the guy head on off, and then I guess I go talk to the Elcor. Uh... <laughs> 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 Uh, the the Elko turns like delighted. Well, hello. It's like I am from the list of corporations. <laughs> <laughs> I am from space. <laughs> I'm gonna go look at the antiques. Okay, okay. you go to look at the antiques. <laughs> Is this how you would politely refer to the old people? I'm uh, gonna go Errol check out the <laughs> antiques. Errol no. just kind of, Errol just kind of goes with you because she's just like, yeah, it just takes her opportunity to leave the Alcor conversation. Uh, <laughs> like, that's I pretty much why I went. <laughs> through her genuine apology when I realized what I brought her into. I go, <laughs> I, I, she's just like sighs because, well, she's <laughs> the other one. <laughs> I say, would you like to go and fetch a drink by any chance? <laughs> uh, wait, Tarina. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> in front of the Elcor. No, no. I, I ask, I ask if if she's thirsty at all. Uh, they just had a drink, so. They... <laughs> it's like that's not a good excuse. It's like I don't want to bring her in for this. That's just mean. <laughs> they did, like literally the first thing you guys did was have a drink when you got in. <laughs> right, damn it! And also, the opportunity for food. Shit. I like I I try I I as subtly as possible like I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> I I ask I ask him in fact what does he think of this of the party and the people at it at the moment. Uh, Rena. Yeah. No, no, the Elcor. The Elcor. What do you? Yeah. What he I, I I I ask him what he thinks of the party and the people here. Um, he seems very like. As, as what you can tell from the very monotone voice is that he seems very happy to be there. It seems like he is newly, like, this is, um, his, he, he just recently got this job and he's very eager to, like, present his product, which is, uh, where is it? Serta Foundation. There it is. They, uh, produce, uh, they are the, uh, corporation who made, uh, wait, no, which, which one? Fuck it. Where is it? Make it up. Do it live. I, I need to know where the, which one uh, is, is the fucking... He's from the corporation that produce... Uh, uh, Guns. Now where is the one that makes Metatron? Roller skates. Oh, the one. Roller skates. El <laughs> Elcor roller skates. <laughs> They're very d in demand, yeah. <laughs> El Corona skates. Produced by the Serta Foundation, I knew it! Right, yes. Don't he's doubt yourself so much, Ronef. You must believe in the heart of the cards. What? Or in the heart of the bullshit. I know. But he's indeed a representative from Serta Foundation. They are, uh, or he is, presenting uh, the newest application of Metagel, um, which is, seems to be like an improved. Uh, met Metagel that does not only like cauterize wounds and uh, cure like poisons and stuff uh, stuff like that, but it can actually um, uh, like it 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 can have like actual like uh, what's it called like neurological like psychological eff effects on people as well. Oh neat. Like I not I not, not like like a it, like it's kind of like a drug, but it's 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 not like it it. 
it put makes people dizzy or like numbing effects or something like that. It's more like um, it calms people down. It makes people uh, less uh, pan, like pant to panic and stuff like that. It's very much aimed towards um, uh, like very like catastrophic. Uh, not it's not military use. It's more like catastrophic civilian use for people who are like. Uh, well, buy a dozen. Yeah, I, I actually say I find myself using Metagel from time to time. I have no doubt you're aware that it gets quite dangerous out there in the in the universe. And I go, I would be delighted if you had some of this to try. <laughs> like I, my Metagel stocks, by the way, guys, I have zero. <laughs> I have none left. So yeah, I can so he, he happily obl uh, obliges, and uh, he he is looking forward to trade Metagel with you in the future. Fantastic. I tell him that uh, any medical supplies, if he would have any interest in directing his way to the Hastrum Allegiance, they are currently without medical specialists and might have quite a use for things like uh, relief and aid supplies. Mm. I'll put it out there. <laughs> I, I should get business he cards. The, he considers the idea. Yeah, I should get business cards. <laughs> yeah, we should. <laughs> Shit. Dude, if I don't get a wealth bonus next level, I'm gonna be miffed. <laughs> like, I'm just make honest. I'm going to bank and work. <laughs> right. So you finish the conversation with the Elcor. You can. I see return this. with snacks. I can't. I, I eat like snacks. It's like ah, I'm full. God, no more snacks. I uh, I offer some to the Elcor. Do you have? The yeah, Elcor just kind of looks at Eric. I don't know how they eat. I just shove it in his face. <laughs> no, <you don't. laughs> no, I just... Uh, that Via osmosis. I don't think by osmosis. You just put food on them and then eventually it becomes one. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? Maybe it's true. I have no idea how they fucking work. Whatever. I like, just offer him and he presumably accepts. I don't know. Yeah, whatever. Um, Greg and Errol are both in uh, in in the antique room. It's, uh, it's paintings and shit like that. It's of uh, all, all sorts of races of uh, of uh, different planets. You can see um, some like uh, some statues that uh, doesn't seem you can't really make out what they actually resemble. They seem to be some sort of like religious thing. I don't know. It's some, some sort of like um, a shrine or something like that. It's a bunch of religious shit. Got it. Yeah, a, b a bunch of religious stuff. Uh, statues of persons, uh, of more Krogans, of uh, actually uh, a Geth and a Korian, like all sorts of races. This I this guy a statue. Yes. I go over and analyze it. What? I'm not in that room. I am. Um, it's made room. out of marble. Okay. That's what you can get from it. Marble statue. It seems to be a very um. It's Recent. it's a, it's. it's no. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's not really an antique. Oh, yeah, no. what the fuck? <laughs> this belongs in a museum. I was lied to. <laughs> <laughs> not an antique anymore. No. I look for a curator. It, not all of them are antiques, but it's like it's it's just statues and paintings and stuff like that. I don't know what to call that in, it's a, in a general fine. It's made their gallery. A gallery. That's a good word. Yeah. Fine. But yes, there is an... I look for a curator. Curator? Yeah, curator. people who know their shit about this gallery. Yeah. Or they're, they're, they're the ones who can tell you... All, it's like you point at a painting and go, what's that? The curator knows. He'll tell you all the shit and more. He'll tell you everything you wanted to know and everything you didn't want to know. Um... Uh, it is a drill that is standing there, and he goes, oh, Yes, would you like to know something? Would you like to know more? Oh, I'm Get glad this is a drill as well, that because it's in a sexy museum. voice. <laughs> Did you know that that belongs in a museum? <laughs> Get statue, information. Ah, yes. Um, it seems that uh, Aphirit, or what is his name? Aphiris Karagna, that's his name. Um... Uh, Ephiris Corona is very interested in different races, uh, policies, and uh, politics, and cultures, and he very recently, uh, the Geth has been more and more uh, considered as a race, 
And therefore, he has put his attention more to them. And, um, well, this signifies his interest, I, I, I would uh, assume. Understood. He doesn't really, like, it doesn't seem to be a very important geth platform. It's just a geth there. It's, it's a normal, you know, engineer class geth. Hmm. Um. Hmm. All, right. All right. Yeah. Um. I thank him and return to the party. Right. To the group, um, basically. What is the old duder doing? The dude. Duder. The yeah. old duder. Um. He is now out on the balcony, and uh, he is starting to gather people up there. Guess I shall proceed to the balcony. Yes. Um, you head out to the balcony. It's uh, it's uh, it, it it feels like it should be windy because you're so high up, but it's not. Um, it's, it's, it, there's no atmosphere. You die. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Yeah, no, you're fine. Yeah, you don't. A meteor. <laughs> Fuck! You are struck by lightning. A reaper what? comes Space by. Light. A reaper comes by with a hamburger and kills you. Um. <laughs> oh. um. Um. It seems like he is starting to pre prepare speech. He's like standing there with his little walking stick in the middle and just uh, looking over people. It's like yes, yes. There's room for everyone. Yes. <laughs> and he takes a step up on a little platform. So it like he has a. He can see everyone, and everyone can see him. And people are sitting down, standing up, and you know, making themselves comfortable, um, having drinks and, and the like. There's like you can see in the uh, in, in the background. So it, it you can see that it's almost like the the lighting of the citadel has has made it into a sunset, hmm. so that it looks very like light yellow orange looks very like I don't know kind of n it's noon ish and um, he he speaks up and he, he presents the binary helix um, biotic amp and he actually holds up in his hand between two fingers his thumb and his uh, middle myth <laughs> no uh, his thumb and another finger, and uh, he's holding like a very small chip. Oh god, he's gonna turn us into Cybermen. <laughs> and, uh. <laughs> Done! <laughs> and, um. He presents it as, uh, the. Uh, a new generation of biotics. Bio Bionics oh have usually, um. um been forced to have some sort of uh, training, some sort of natural uh, either natural uh, uh, skill with biotics and uh, he says that with this thing biotics can be created out of uh, out of uh, whoever uh, is, is skilled enough to use it I, uh, not, I look not... at the rest of the party with, the, with like my eye like looking sad begging for this thing I, can I don't I, think it works he, on robots. He, and, and, and he also um, uh, points out yes. that um, <laughs> that the that the most important thing of this device it's is that it 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 does not require a biological means. Uh, of neurological. Of course not. <laughs> yes. Or neurological uh, connection with the biotic amp. Therefore. Robots, machines, weaponry, industry, industry, AIs of all kind, even computers, even your Omni tools, can have biotic power, biotic capabilities. Interesting. Hmm. And, and the crowd just kind of goes with a very, like, you know, it's like little clapping. <gasps> Oh yes. I, 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 I wait until there's you know there's a break in a little clapping and I, I raise a hand. 
I raise a hand before all these people. Yes, and he he lowers the, the chip a bit. He's still holding it up so everyone can see. And um, he goes, yes, any questions? Is there any proof that you could show us that it works? Oh, on a... Oh, on a robotic? Yes, I believe that you've seen my Geth companion here, DLK. It would be fantastic if we could see it in action. God, I have no fucking regret on this. <laughs> <laughs> um, he goes, um... Oh, a demonstration like this would probably take, um... Quite a while to apply, but um, I probably... am a quick learner. Oh, and he he chuckles and he chuckles and goes, uh, "Oh, it's not about learning, my little robot. It's about the app actual ap um, application to your platform, so to speak. Um, it's a very delicate process, and if put in." In incorrectly can have devastating effects. You must understand. I understand. I, I speak for it before he insists. I go, I understand. <laughs> Greg, you're taking that and you're putting it in my skull. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> you're taking two, so you can do that as well. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck it, take three. One for Chuck as well. <laughs> oh shit, Chuck. yeah, we got, we've <laughs> definitely got to get one for Chuck. Chuck Norris? No, 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 Chuck. You know, Chuck, my bug man. Oh yeah. <laughs> little egg, it's going to stick a chip to an egg. There you go. Oh god, it's become too powerful. <laughs> <laughs> I could not have known. <laughs> no, we should make Gronk a bionic. No. Oh, no, no, That's no. a bad idea. <laughs> He's bad There's enough There's been Krogan biotics before. Rex was a fucking biotic. Well, yeah, but we'd rather have Chuck. I mean, imagine but, him throwing things around with biotic powers. Um, I can imagine, and the, the imaginations are pretty uh, destructive. Exactly. Uh -huh. right, I'm gonna train uh, him. You as well. Interesting. Okay, so how many announces that ago? That's understandable. Uh. I've noticed, I'm sure that you don't mind me mentioning, that you have uh, quite a base of biotic power yourself. Have you actually Upgrade. tested this product on anyone nearby that could actually just show it in use? You know, one that is not naturally bi biotic? Because again, this all sounds very wonderful, but the application is the proof in and of itself. Even if we can't really have it installed in our get friend here straight away. He, he uh, chuckles a bit uh, again and goes, um, Oh, I see him. You're very eager to see um, um, a demonstration, and a, de and a demonstration you will get. And, um, <laughs> and then everyone becomes Cyberman. <laughs> I'm waiting for you it. You all die. No. Um, you shall be deleted, 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 <laughs> deleted, deleted, exterminate. Right. Oh fuck, Daleks! Oh god! <laughs> Daleks come down from the sky. This is not what I signed up for. <laughs> this is ex exactly what you signed up for. Right, um... He, uh... He, um, calls out a, very ge uh, a little gently and goes, Hey, Fio! And, and the back in the crowd, you can see um, a female Turian st stepping forward. Aww. Um... You can see... And she then steps up on the platform and turns around that you remember this Turian. Oh god. Oh god. I knew it was going to be her. I don't, Wait, what? because I've never met her before. It's the Turian from the alleyway, right? Yep. Yeah. I Drake glance know at this. her. I, I, yeah, no. I look at her and think, oh shit. <laughs> Damn it. Um, um, I put my head before down. Before you all get the... the, the Get horrible thoughts like this. She does not look like she's her wife. But she's his wife. <laughs> well, that wasn't. He's very much younger. It's... <laughs> um. That never stopped an old rich guy. It's. Wow. Well, um, um. And he. Um... 
he looks at her and goes, um, well, she wanted a demonstration. And she go and she um she closes her eyes and uh, you can see, now see that um um a fear is, is now starting to levitate from the ground. He just takes off his feet, just you know, going down because there's no solid ground there anymore. He he, ta he gets his uh, legs up and like, what was that like when you sit with your legs crossed? Sitting with your legs crossed. Yeah. That's what it's called. All right, cool. <laughs> uh, yeah, he goes like that. He puts his uh, um, walking stick and just um, on there very gently and, and, and goes and just puts his hands out a bit just like and um, stretches a bit and then like puts his hands on on his knees and um, and then he puts out his hand and he points at the at Thomas and it's like and Thomas starts to not levitate oh this is amazing he puts down his hand as if and he's looking around like as if he's choosing who's going to be uh, levitated and he uh, chooses um, the Elcor <laughs> the Elcor starts to levitate at the same height as the others. He's just, he's just like, like, how much power do I think it's supposed to be toting to be able to just sort of casually lift all these guys? Hmm? How much power do I think has to be used to like casually levitate all these guys? Um, quite a lot, especially since uh, he uh, she's now holding three people up in the air. Actually, never mind. You are the only one. Uh, who uh, you as you uh, as far as you know is the only one who um, uh, recognized that that the uh, the guy the Afir is is lifting himself up but she is actually lifting up the two others uh, he just wanted to get into a fucking comfortable position I don't know <laughs> um, and um he, uh, he he first goes. Um, I hope you don't mind a little turbulence, and uh, the the. Oh God, he's gonna turn your organs into paste. <laughs> Jesus fuck! You can see that the Elcor is now starting to tilt. Oh fuck! He's starting to sp to spin around and very slowly, like not like. Oh, we rotate then. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so yeah. When you say spin, I'm thinking, oh God, washing machine. No. <laughs> <laughs> now you're thinking of Seth. <laughs> wow, Dan. Right. Uh, no, he's he's rotating around. Um, it's it's late. Sometimes he's upside down. He's like, and he's just like amazed. This is amazing. It's like, <laughs> um, and Thomas <laughs> worried. I think I'm going to puke. <laughs> Thomas is put upside down. What? And then, and then you are li uh, let down, uh, very, very very slowly down to the ground. You touch the floor, and then you feel like you're being held there. You literally like with your head, just to the floor, and your body straight up. I think I might shit myself. <laughs> Doing an um, Elcor impression now. I get that you've got no charisma, but I remember you having enunciation. <laughs> You're like, you know, feels, yeah. pants. You can now hear it inside your head. What? Her voice. Telling. She tracks the death net, kill her. No, everyone can hear this. Oh, I don't. Yeah, yes, no, I listen real hard. I hear this as well. Um, that you, she, um, she says, the demonstration is now over. When she Ow. reaches out, I try and reach back into her head. I follow after her. Is that a will check? That is indeed yes. a will check. That is a 19 sound. Does a 19 work for you? Um, that's on the dice. I haven't even added my bonuses. Jesus fuck. How much is that's that? That's, that's, a that's a 21 will. In fact, will I think willpower is in fact its own thing. Oh no, same bonus. So yeah, 21 willpower. You definitely beat her. <laughs> um, awesome. I take a peek in and say, why hello there, do you remember me? She opens her eyes and everyone falls down. 
God. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't hear anything, so I just sort of. Yeah, no, no. Like no one else would have heard that but her. Uh, if there's, uh, if there's this. No, I didn't even hear her. If, like, if, yeah, you, Thomas, heard her. I told you several times. You how? heard her. You did. You just did. The shit was whack. Because it works on non. Did you not listen? The technology works on non biotics. Like, not... you, in use. But not by getting into a computer. Why not? You heard it. It functions. It allows the, the, them to the, do the, it, the so why shouldn't it be able really to. Weird auto, in a really weird context, the geth think, and that's why it works. You heard sure. it, Thomas. You don't know yeah, how. Okay. You don't really <laughs> Aliens! know. Aliens! Wait a second. <laughs> but. But it happened. And I scurry confused. over to Greg and say, This is not supposed to happen. <laughs> um, it's fine. The crowd is, gets a little bit like. Get surprised like when they just get dropped down and she goes oh shit you know just kind of like fuck. okay hey uh sorry about that don't panic though so what was it what is it you're doing here what a, what a surprise to meet again just, just get out of my fucking head <laughs> like okay yeah, there's no need to be rude if there is kind of looks at uh, what she what she can feel by the way isn't me like intruding it's like you know when imagine like the brain is a house i'm still on the outside of the door just talking through the open doorway like I'm not in there. I'm just You're sort of still speaking. talking to her. I am still like, talking to her. And okay. Okay, that's not very nice. is just looking at his daughter uh, at his daughter and goes, and uh, and just kind of goes, oh well, seems like we do need some training after all. <laughs> okay, I'm really sorry about that. <laughs> and then I back out of her head. Uh, as she's levitating down, um. And it puts his feet down on the ground, and he bends over a bit with, with, with his um, with his back, like he's very like crooked, crooked back. Hunted it down to his little walking stick again, and uh, <laughs> um, the Turian like Aphio is still like standing there, like very like <clears throat> that was embarrassing kind of thing, but he, he goes. Um, I'm, I deeply apologize for this. Um, next time, I will uh, bring a more trained professional to the scene <coughs> to make uh, proper demonstrations. Now, thank you, daughter. Thank you, father. I, cla she... I, I, I clap loudly. Like, you know, you, you know when someone starts to clap with her? Yeah, the crowd joins in, like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Like, yeah, it's the start. <laughs> <laughs> clunk, 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 clunk. Yeah. And, um, the people seem to, like, um, move back in into the locales again. Start to talk about what happened. And, uh, Ephiris is, uh, standing outside on the balcony talking to Aphiel. Yeah. And then Ephiris, uh, uh, walks inside while Aphio uh, sits down outside. You can see um, that Ephirius, um looks a bit upset, but he doesn't look too worried about. Him. He doesn't look too worried. He looks more like um, ah, ready to talk with some more people, you know. Yeah, I walk on over and settle down next to him, and I'm, I, I bring a drink with me and then hold it out for him. To who? To the man outside, first. To a few. Yeah, a few. A, a, a fed. A few. It's a her. If yeah, words are hard. <laughs> um. Yeah, you sit down. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm really sorry. It's been it's a long cool. day at work. It's, it's cool. so hard for me to. Um. She looks up at you, and she kind of goes, "And what the hell are you doing here?" Uh, I sit down and go, I wish I could tell you myself. We've been kind of... How do I put it? We've been looking into what actually happened. And I think you know what I mean when I say what actually happened. And our leads didn't get us too far, but this seemed like one of those opportunities just a bit too big to pass up. 
And it's kind of an interesting coincidence that after bumping into you, you turn out to be his daughter. Well, isn't that something? Look, I don't know what kind of plans you have, but I'm not making any plans of any, you know, taking over the council and stuff like that. I never I said taking over the council. I pair yeah. it. <laughs> and she, she, she just goes, no, no, no. just <laughs> Okay, yeah, like, I, I put my hands up. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just busting balls. No, I don't expect anything like that, but I'm wondering um, what it is you that you see. actually do. Um, but I was, also, I'm still uh, holding By, it by the table, you it. can see that there's a chair placed. On the other, um, like, it's a, it's like a, round, a small round table, like a cafe little table, and you can see on the side there's a chair that being placed, and the male Turian uh, sits down. And he looks at you, Dan, and goes, "What? Really, you again?" And then I, he looks. I at just give. I just give him, goes, I, Really? I, I just sort of give him a brief wave, and then like, and then just like, "Oh, that's cool." And then continue talking to her. <laughs> like, uh, I'm sorry that I broke your concentration as well. That wasn't cool. <laughs> yeah, thank you a lot. I, I really needed that. <clears throat> Could have not have. But, you know, a ben better opportunity, better situation to talk to me or anything like that. No, you had to pick that I got, I got, specific I got, situation. But, I got, but when is such a pretty girl ever going to be in my head again? Xantas uh, puts 16. his... What? <laughs> Bluff check, 16. Xantas puts I rolled a his, six, that's miserable. Puts his elbows on, on the table, leans forward and start, and just looks at you now. I know, I like continue to just not pay attention to him. I like, go, <laughs> you know when someone gets nervous, they're like, he's not, if I don't make eye contact, it's not happening. <laughs> like, I can just continue to sit there. I go over and take, look, look, I make eye contact with the guy sitting. I'm like, <laughs> but what you be, D dude, if you have to do that, you're literally like walking next to Dan. Yeah, Kneeling down and just, <laughs> just <laughs> staring, having your head next to Dan, and just being like, mm. <laughs> "Yeah, sounds good." <laughs> no, I give him a nudge when he tries it. No, behave. I have no idea who these people are. Uh, yeah, like I you didn't even this. tell yeah. me this is ha you, yeah, this no, is I, happening. I, I quickly go. Can you go explain the situation to our other companions here? I do not know the situation. It wasn't there. Wait, was he? Thomas was there, wasn't Thomas he? Thomas was there, Thomas yes. There. Yeah, we chased those guys into the alleyway. These are those Corians. I just... That doesn't explain the situation Corians. to me. I tell him that he... Like, I, I explain... Well, Quentino has never heard of these people and he has no idea who I'm talking to. Do you want to go fill him in, maybe? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> I look at the others like... <sighs> Alright, so Thomas tells Greg now about the... Uh, Why don't you not? Hmm? What? Like, why don't you not tell me? Like, I don't care that I don't know, but they also don't know me, just pointing that out. I will communicate this to you as you come over to me. You're like, I don't want to fucking know. <laughs> tell me who they are. <laughs> <laughs> you're, just, you're just so worried about how fucking crazy we are. I, like, return, to, I return to Dan. He doesn't want to know. Mission gun? No, he just thought uh, mission, mission accomplished. <laughs> yeah, you're like, I'm done. I succeeded like, with incredible speed within the parameters. <laughs> but be before you even get to me, I'm going to tell you this because I have a like communicator thing. So, so they still don't you, know. You just take off a walk, dog. Just like fuck off. Fuck no, off. like I, I have a thing in my heads up display. I'm just display. imagining Thomas like starting like, to walk up to him, and he just picks up a walk guitar. He's just like, no, stop. Okay, turn, turn around. And I, then, yeah. I have walk, a thing walk out, walk out. in my further, heads up further. display. One, one more step. Just All right, good. Go tell someone else. I don't want to know. They don't know who I am either. Yeah. True. Good. So um, I go over to an Elcor and start conversation. It's like a random person. <laughs> yeah. The only Elcor that's there is the guy from Sir Foundation. <laughs> I would love to, like, just like in reality, it's like an Elcor and a Geth talking to each other. Just fucking mind blowing, really. <laughs> they now think 
some random Elcor is associated with you and have no Theoretically, idea. Theoretically, yes. <laughs> they think his name is Quentino. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um. Yeah, no. Uh, I, I ask her then, like, so what were you doing all the way on Omega? Um, she she looks down again. So, why why is that even your business? Like, well, I mean, why is that her business? She she, she looks at uh, the uh, the Turian and, and he's and he breaks um, uh, eye contact with you, Dan, and he looks at her and just and goes, ah, "This is just great." <laughs> I like I look between them both and go, "Okay, okay, this has gone on long enough." You obviously don't seem to believe that I'm anything other than full of shit. <laughs> and I, I well, like, is that correct? Do you believe that I am only full of shit right now? Well, not all shit. I mean, you know, a bunch of bullshit, yes, but... There you have it. That's, that's essentially what I was getting at. But no. <laughs> what, what? What, I'm, what I actually am is, I'm trying to make a profit. I'm also trying to figure out who the fuck broke my brain open and did weird stuff to it to make me kill a bar full of people. I'm also wondering why random people that I bumped into in Omega turned up over here at a party that I was asked to go to by the Bounty Hunter, who I also spoke to briefly after meeting you lot. <laughs> Just putting it out there, there's a lot of coincidences going on, oh, and God, you see God. me asking you a very simple question. What the fuck uh, were you doing on Omega? The, the, the male attorney goes, but, like, the Bounty Hunter? You talked to him? Yeah, nice guy. Several fucking times. Although, I mean, I mean, I, I go. Looks, in fact, I'm not even spe specifically sure the bounty hunter's a guy, but that's neither he here nor there. He looks at uh, Atheel, and he looks very worried. And uh, Atheel kind of looks back, then looks at you, Dan, and goes, "Did you look? I, I look. I'm not gonna get into your business because that's probably the worst thing we can probably do right now. But really." The bounty hunter? He doesn't talk to anyone. Oh, um, there's nobody. He was kind of nice and polite, really, once we got past the fight, initially. Well, we are on a mission for him. Yeah, I mean, we it's don't like... Talk. I'm I mean, talking he, to he, an he, alpha, I, 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 In fact, I, I pick it up, I'm like, he gets us places. <laughs> um, in fact, as I, as I look around this, this hallway and lift my hands up, it's like, you know, this is the evidence. He's a good guy. <laughs> just, just now I am bullshitting them. Yeah, <laughs> uh, and and uh, if if you uh, again goes, you don't understand. He doesn't, he doesn't talk to anyone, ever. Well, if if, if he appears, if he appears, you're probably dead. And the fact that you're not, and you met him, I. Oh. He looks, she looks at the turn and goes, Santa's here. Do you think that could be this could be happening? Uh, like a normal person? He goes, no, no, no. <laughs> anyone normal? Who... <laughs> Come on now, anything but. <laughs> He's just like, no, no. <laughs> I've heard people who I've heard people say they met him, but I don't believe them. I mean, I I just very very briefly show them the message, and I don't give I don't show them any of the details of the conversation we've had. But it's like, look, see that ID. A great big anonymous smear on my army tool, and then I put it away again. Uh, See, I'm not saying anyone that. It is anonymous, so you can't really. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Me, oh, right, like, oh yeah, you. It's, it's, so it's like I thought, like encrypted and shit. But if it's actually just oh. like an anonymous messenger, then I guess I don't show him anything. It's anonymous. It's yeah. Oh, it's like getting a message from 4chan then. Hey. Op. <laughs> Op. No. Op is fag. <laughs> no, I look at them and go, okay, maybe you don't believe me. And I, I, I sort of uh, tap my chin and go, but say if that were true that the bounty hunter never spoke to anyone. If he was speaking to someone, why would he do that? <laughs> like, why would the bounty hunter show interest in someone if that's the case? Kind of concerned. Oh, it was, um... Santos, as you found out that the male Turian is named, um, answers, well, well, the only ones he would not kill would be someone he probably knows. Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. kind of looks at Santos again, goes, really? 
he goes like 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 really are you are you fucking serious kind of thing and and uh santa's go like yeah i get up and go <laughs> i've really... got to i've got to go do something <laughs> like i just back away from them they both like follow you like at your entire walk inside <laughs> and they go like really <laughs> <laughs> like i look at them both and go i just need to go quickly and uh, if you guys could just wait here, I will literally be back in like a minute. You know, just, just put it on the chill. One second. I finished my conversation with an Elcor, which has been enlightening. <laughs> yeah, no, I go, I go back to Thomas and Rena and... Quentin, they like fist you know. <laughs> No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, no, I don't go over to them then, but I, I, gra I gather my other bunch and I say... Um, okay, so... I can hear you just fine. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I speak <laughs> coincidentally in your vicinity, I go. Um... So, kind of a big deal right now. Uh, I happen to have met and had the gun pointed at me before by those lovely Tyrians over there. Uh, thing is, one of them is the daughter of the boss man who's Omnitool we're after. Uh, kind of a thing. We need to get that Omnitool and we can probably use them to do it. Because it turns out that the bounty hunter probably has got a weird thing going on with all of us because we're not dead. I thought it was the chair. I hang my head. <laughs> what? I'd be inclined to agree. He didn't kill us because he thought <laughs> my chair combat style was so <laughs> intense. That's clearly the only logical And then he disarmed all of you. Uh, yeah. He retreated because got... his ribs were broken. He left me with the chair, though. <laughs> <laughs> the real weapon! No, I look at him and go, So, I'm just going to ask because I don't want to just make this decision on everyone's behalf. I'm going to try and get them, use them to try and get the Omni tool because I bet there's a lot of interesting shit on there. And before I give it to the Bounty Hunter, I want to look at it. Do you guys agree? I'd rather chop his armor. I, <coughs> I can just make a copy. <coughs> okay, I ask her, like, how does he, like, how, what's the easiest way for him to make a copy? Well, it's all data. I can just take it and make a copy. Copy, paste. <laughs> but how would we get the data off of him? I don't know. By That's stealing. the thing. I need. I. It's I, most likely passworded and encrypted and, and all sorts of stuff. Yeah, we I have. Mean, right. It will actually just be. Yeah, I mean, we have someone who can help crack it, and we also have a Geth who tends out to be a gigantic machine. If he goes to the Geth and just asks them to break it for him, he, they will do it. I would imagine. It's not that difficult. Yeah, I, I have a billion times. algorithms in my head. That's very true. So I, I, I asked, like, all right, then, have you got anything then to download it on? Because I guess we need to try and make a move now and leave, because I think shit might get real. I don't know why. Getting that feeling. I can just put it onto my own Omni tool, right? Like, I've broken it without any particular tools before. And most of my computer tools are on my Omni tool anyway. Makes sense. So do we have to grab the Omni tool off of him, copy it, and then hand it back to him or something? Like, get it back no, to him? No. If we find a way to... Uh, I don't know, knock him out or something. Because huh. it's in him, it's quite difficult to take them from him. It uh, requires surgery. Okay. To get the actual physical army tool, it is an actual chip that has been put basically on the side of the skeleton on the arm so it doesn't like uh, impair with any, any movement. I, or, I always figured that it was more like, you know, the Fallout Vats machine. <laughs> No, no. <laughs> it's, it, it's, it, it's why you can't see anyone have anything on the arm, and then suddenly they have, like, an Omni tool in it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I go, um, alright. Okay. I so if right, we I, 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 I look to go, I will be right back, and then I walk back over to the two Turians. I say, I do Is not want surprised that you're back? Yeah, no, I go, I, I said I'll be back, I'm not a liar. For the most part. Um, <laughs> I go... Okay, so I kind of need information off the old man's Omni tool. I'm not fond of the idea of knocking him unconscious and cutting off his arm. Uh, can either of you two do something to help me? Uh, <laughs> I don't know why you think they're gonna help you. Like, I'm, just playing a hunt I'm playing a hunt right now. I'm a mysterious stranger. <laughs> I'm telling them that I'm doing this for the good of mankind. Well, we're not mankind. Uh, d for all kind. Good of galaxy kind. Yeah, no, okay. Um. 
we're uh, not. If, I don't, if I'm not uh, mistaken, you did say your name in the alley. Yeah, yeah, no, they know my actual name. Mm -hmm. Shit. Um. Dan, diplomacy check, do it. Uh, that would be uh, diplomacy 25. Pretty good. Yeah. I um, get a I get a nine modifier to my diplomacy checks. They seem quite surprised that you just asked that from them. Yeah, no, um, I, I'm like quite like, I'm saying that I'm probably going to get that information one way or the other. I would rather do it this way. And um, Santa's um kind of leans forward and goes, "Are you threatening him?" And uh, Aphio kind of goes, "But." Let's hear him out before we kill him. Okay, I, I like to go. Thank you. <laughs> and, and and Xantus kind of, you can see that he literally has his hand on on uh on, on his gun on his side. I I'm I'm still holding. I like the the little. I've got no weapons. No hand raising thing. I'm like, look. I don't need weapons. Yeah, no, no, no. I, it's just me over here. Don't fuck things up for me, D. Okay. <laughs> um. No, I, I, I go, look, okay. Z Things uh, are Zant a lot more serious than they appear. What do you guys know about that chip? About what? About the chip, you know, the biotic chip. I tell them, like, I ask them, like, what do you actually know about that thing? About the Omni tool? No, mm -hmm. the biotic thing that makes everyone... Ah, okay, yeah. Brain nerd. Um... Not more than... Not more than you know in this presentation. I, I go, I was afraid that was the case. So why do you think the bounty hunter would have been interested in this me in this little meeting here? That he would have sent me along. Well, that's probably the problem. Nice. with his... Um, Xantas is very quiet. He's, like, again, like, keeping quite an eye on you, and he's still... You know, you can see uh, on his side there's a little pocket where his gun is supposed to be, and... The pocket is like open and. <laughs> what are you gonna say? And the pocket is empty because the gun is in his hand and it's pointed at. <laughs> no, his... it is in his hand and he's holding it. It's just still in the holster. He's literally holding it, like. I don't. I don't. I don't look down at the gun. I don't acknowledge that he's, fact. He, he's. He's literally like. Uh, just looking at you, and just ready to. to, to uh, I just say. Gunslinger. Would you I say. Would you rather the bounty hunter came and did this? Because I m imagine that he won't survive that meeting, will he? Um. <laughs> a, Diplomacy check! No. No need. Uh, Aphio goes, I don't think he wanted to do this mission. I think he wanted you to do this mission. Yeah, exactly. But what happens if I, he's forced to show his hand and do it himself? Um, Xantas, Xantas with still his gun, his hand on his gun, with his other hand, he's like, with his other hand, he puts his on the table, uh, and, um, and he looks very seriously at you, and he's like, you don't understand, if he, if he, if you weren't doing this, I don't think he would be doing this. What makes you say that? And 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 he and then he looks at at Aphio, as if he's trying to like confirm something, and Aphio very he just thinks for a while and sighs and then go, just go for it, <laughs> just kind of kind of like, what shoot me? <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> no. Um, she goes, go for it and. Please put that down. <laughs> and then he goes like, and just puts like the gun down the holster and closes it. He very angrily does that, but <laughs> <laughs> he tries. I I do my best not to go. Oh fuck, fucking sweet Jesus and Christ! And he he then looks at you, um, and says. Well, I thought it would be obvious if you wanted, if you have met this person before, you've had an amnesia, he probably wants to make sure you are the person he knew. 
And if you, and he, if you, you go, you, you, don't th you don't, you think he literally knew me before now? Hey, you figures, I don't, I don't know. He must have known you in some way. He definitely okay. seems to know you're the person for this kind of oh, stuff. Oh shit! Are we specials? <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, that'd be a twist. They're after us because we're after us. Oh, fuck! Oh, no. <laughs> I, go, I go, you're giving me a lot to think about. Bitch, I'm the first get Spectre. <laughs> Theoretically, we only need yeah. one. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> get Spectre. I go, I, I nod and stand up to leave. To leave? Yeah, do yeah, as in, as in I'm gonna go head over to the old man now. <laughs> okay. Alright, so I walk up to- And, and Atheo again goes, so how are you gonna do it? I'm like, I'm, I'm just, I just shrug and go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wing it. <laughs> and then I walk up to the old man. She looks at Santa's again, it's like, sometimes I do wonder why we don't shoot him. <laughs> I mean, for his own good! <laughs> Guys, I'm pretty sure we're the bad guys. <laughs> we have I, a Terminator. I, 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 like, nod down to, the, like, one of the, to, like, just outside the main area. Towards the bottom. Okay. I, I go, I go, um... I don't even know how to approach this without just, like, a really dirty thing. I say, I have something of the utmost importance that I must show you, and I don't feel safe. <laughs> Yeah, I know. And I don't feel safe doing so with all of these people around. Would you be okay, my lord, if we just, you know, went off to the side quickly? He goes, oh, well. <laughs> this is so <laughs> difficult. I know, right? It's <laughs> Are you seriously just asking him? Yeah, I'm seriously just asking Elsewhere. him to a place with me. So you can bonk him on the head? Yes. Okay. Mm. <laughs> like, fuck this noise. Alright, I'm gonna do it the real way. Do you need a stronger fist? Uh, that's why I've had the cane. You guys, you know, go ahead. I, that was, that's not. No, Thomas. I don't want to. I don't want to. Right, he, he, he goes, oh, what's this? What's this matter? So, what is what's he? Is he something with so to, like, you know, a quiet way? I still have plenty of guests to. To talk with. I say, so I think your life might be in danger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wonder if you don't say. <laughs> he looks a bit uh, worried now. Like the the first time you've actually seen him in a in another mood than very kindly happy. <laughs> yeah, I, I say, I've been sent by important people to ensure that doesn't happen. Is there anyone in particular that you are worried about right now? Like, I say this with the utmost seriousness, and I make a bluff check, uh, and that would be 27. Well, anything or anyone. Like, yeah, is, is there anything right now that's threatening him? What? What do you mean, like, any any competitors? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, like, is there a group, anyone in particular that he's fearing? Like, is there any anything that you want to... Is there anything that's bothering you right now? Is there anyone you think that has it in for you this evening? He he goes, no, not that I know of. Would, okay, would, then. I I, 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 ho I do hope they don't want to kill me, because that don't usually work. Yeah, no no doubt. I imagine that. Uh, I, I think that you could quite easily kill a whole group of people with no problem at all. I've noticed that you're kind of incredibly powerful. Well, that's most kind of you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm just like... And then I, I, I like widen my eyes as though in surprise and look over his shoulder slightly. And wait for him to turn around. <laughs> what are you expecting to happen? <laughs> I gotta make him look over his shoulder and then hit him in the back of the head. Did oh, he does not... did he actually go already? He yeah, he went with me. Look, he does not look over. He looks very he looks at you. I don't know, my bluff check says that that's twenty six. Does he look over his fucking shoulder? No. <laughs> Damn it. Make a will check. He's reading your mind, bitch. That's fine, I got willpower. I got willpower! I got 22 willpower! Is that a crit? That's a crit. <laughs> Motherfucker. He's about to mindfuck you. No, it's a crit. He can't. It's... Sure he can. I can fight him! It's a crit! 
<laughs> it was a crit failure, maybe he just watched me curl up and cry and go, I'm a sham, I'm gonna lie. But no, not today! <laughs> Right, um... <laughs> okay. So he kind of, kind of still looks at you. And he goes... Just... So... What's this danger you're talking about? I tell him, the bounty hunter. The bounty hunter? He sounds with like... Like, up voice, like, the bounty hunter? Oh. Is that so? Yes. Hmm. Would pit the bounty hunter against me? He yeah. kind of is just probably puts... a fucking bounty. Okay. I go, I go, I, yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah, but who? Yeah. Made no, him. Go, do you do you do you think you would have a chance against the bounty hunter? What him? Yeah. Oh, I have no. I have never seen him in action. I'm sorry. I've only heard tales. I'm telling you right now, they're basically all true. <laughs> I he know. contemplates for a second, and he he um he goes. Now, uh, hmm, this person is very dangerous indeed. That's correct. But how do I know you are not the bounty hunter? Uh. That's a very... You know what? Actually, I ask myself that question sometimes. <laughs> I ask myself... Like, I, it's a question I've legitimately asked myself since seeing Bounty Hunter hands appear on me. Do you go, say that? Yeah. No, no, no. I go... <laughs> no, I don't I don't actually... Like, when Bounty he asks... I'm like... Like, he sees, he's... You know, like, he says that and he sees me go wistfully off in the distance in my own mind. Like, that's a very good question, man. I fucking am. <laughs> no, I go... Uh, I don't know. Maybe I would have already came and stopped and killed you if that were the case. I certainly wouldn't have tried to face you one-on-one. -on -one. I'd have just done it when you weren't expecting it. <laughs> Mind <laughs> trust! <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that would be very effective. No, it isn't. I um, hope that my companions come and help me soon. <laughs> I walk in. <laughs> Well, that's a skull. Just bonk him on the back of the head. Just go yeah, bonk him. Yeah, no, okay. Yeah. He's trying to bonk this man. Okay. Can I go in there and do that? There are people in the locale. Oh, they're like, we're still nearby. You're okay. still in the main hall. What? We're in the main hall. Where the statue is and all the food and stuff like that. I thought you went away with me to the side already. Damn it. Okay. You uh, are on the side, but you're still in the room. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. He hasn't left the like um, the, the the sight of guards and and people in general. Okay then, I'm gonna try for a different approach and be mysterious and shit. Cause that's worked for me so far. I just sort of turn away from him and walk towards like the hallway out and just nod over my shoulder as though I expected him to follow and I don't look back. <laughs> God damn it. Make another will check. Uh, oh my God. Eighteen. Eighteen. Eighteen's reasonable, right? Well, we can yeah. see it's good enough, right? <laughs> sure um, so you walk out of the, the, the hall, yeah? Yep. Um, as you look back, you can see that he's actually following. <laughs> I try, not, again, I try not to let out the usual utterance. Oh, thank fuck God. <laughs> and see as that I he's following. The, yep. He's, uh. he's uh, um, saying goodbye to some, like, uh, people on the way out, and he's like uh, nodding and like waving his hand a little bit. So, oh yes, goodbye and whatever. <laughs> yeah, and then as he turns the corner, like break his leg. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I, do, I wait for him to go around the corner, and I assume that you guys have already gone off to the side and waited. Then we'll right. get him in the elevator. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we'll just, okay. Yeah. Um, I walk up to the elevator, and you guys are waiting. The elevator. You go and go in. Two guards follow in. That's Shit. Fine. We can knock him out. Yeah, no. I mean, they I can do spawn, that. They both stand, they both stand uh, beside him in in, in 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 on either side of him, like behind I, him. But I'm not him. gonna follow directly. By the way, I'm gonna wait. Okay, cool. Actually, you know what? They're all As in the elevator. It's about to go down. Okay, 
Sweet. Is there a second elevator shaft, or is it only the one? It's only the one. It's a big elevator. So a lot of people that can uh, fit into that elevator. Well, like a fate, man. Is is there oh, any yeah. guards left at the top? Uh, yes. Okay. Probably about like ten in total. They're like scattered. Like, right. uh, <laughs> but are, are they in like view of the elevator? There are two other guards that are in view of the elevator to the entrance of the uh, of the place. Mm. <laughs> well, let me guess. You wanted to jump on top, didn't you? I did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought as much. No, I just wait until we're all in the elevator, and the moment it goes down, I just does hit... Greg go inside? Yeah. Um, sorry, you come along. Okay. All right. Uh, sorry, mm. indeed. Yeah. Like guys as well. I'll go okay. Up. Cool. Um, the moment that we're like halfway down in the elevator, I hit that emergency alarm thing. It just makes the lift shut down and stop. And then I attack the guards. I'll be like, whoa, what's going on? Right before he attacks the guards. And, and yeah, I mean, I bluffed well, miraculously. <laughs> what was the point of that bluff? Um, so that the guards don't... So they didn't so see you hit the button. No one thinks I did anything by it. Right. <laughs> you just want to, you just, you just want to, you want plausible I, deniability when they kill I had no part of this, that basically. That works. You definitely, they did, they did not notice that it was you. Like, awesome. no one thinks I have anything to so do Dan, with this. <laughs> Dan, you get a surprise attack. What well, actually is my so, buff? Can I get a, a surprise attack as well? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Okay, okay, so yeah, I'll take one Punch guard, you. you take the other. <laughs> you got punching? Right. I noticed now that I have no weapons on me. Yeah. This is a fact, yes. isn't it? You do not have weapons. Thankfully, I have Mind Crush. You have 22 mind crush. in attack. Uh, I don't know what my oh, uh, it's eighteen. Okay. Um, both roll damage. Fourteen damage with a punch. Cause I rolled eight out of eight, plus six. I'm oh God. I got a rough D threes of damage, so it's actually on a D six. I rolled a five, so that is a three, right? Yeah. Okay. Cool. So three plus two is three. Yeah, okay, so I, I punch a guard in the brain for five. Five. I punch a guy in the face for 14. Okay. Okay, the I think guy, I see what Thomas, you're Thomas uh, punches in, uh, in the face, knocks down, and just falls to the ground. Um, yeah, he's knocked unconscious. Um, while the other guard uh, takes a hit. In the and, brain. And you can see that his... Uh, that, uh, like... They, they they all had little like crowns on on their head. Like it, 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 all of them were Turian. Ah, shit, biotic shield. And uh, no, there's no uh, biotic shield uh, not that that you know of. Um, and the, the, they had a little crown on their head that's like decorative, and it like just flies off, you know. And uh, it, not, not much else happens. He just kind of just very surprisingly just looks over at you in the confusion. He then. Swings over his staff to try and um, try and trip Dan. So okay. I will make a roll. God, I hope it's against my reflex check. <laughs> that thing, I get a plus four. I imagine good. it's probably against your AC. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh. Uh, it's an 18. Yeah, that's going to hit me. Right. So trip means you are not prone. Oh shit! Okay, isn't it? Yeah, something like no. that, probably. Yeah. You are not prone. Uh, a Ferris stands there, and uh, you guys. Um, you guys can make a, a roll now. I know oh, I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna bother initiative. There's only one guard. Oh, okay. okay, I rolled a, um, that is, twenty five. See, I wanted to do like a right, like my move actually to stand up. My action is to punch, so I just do a Shoryuken from the ground. And, well. Shoryuken! I mean, you don't have metal fists, nor have I you know, been leveling it strength. Would be a shuriken. Thomas knocks him on the head and he falls over. His <laughs> just, his head goes right into the, the, the side of the. I didn't head. even roll damage! You hit really hard. <laughs> it's safe to assume. I mean, I did still punch the guy in the brain. True. <laughs> right. So, if Ferris 
kind of stands there and, 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 and just looks out uh, of the view. And he, and he goes, quite a lovely place, isn't it? And he looks I, over at yeah, the Yeah, it is really quite nice out there. I'm going to cower in the corner right up until they knock him out. <laughs> Fucking damn. Dude, he turns dead. to you guys and he, and he goes, so... <laughs> and he chuckles, he just chuckles a bit and he looks over at you guys. Every My single one make, crush! Ma every single one make a well check. Me? What did I do? Every single one. I didn't do anything. I uh, failed. Uh, Epically. Hey, actually, never mind, not Greg, because he's not been revealed. Haha! Good, because I critically fail. <laughs> he discovers uh, you're with us. Are, are you sure he doesn't want to attack my fortitude instead of my will? Because <laughs> I fucked up. Uh, no. 14, 14 is not going to cut it. 14 and Thomas. 18. 18. Eight? That's a lot of willpower for a robot. I'm proud of you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, it's not. It's it's fortunately not charisma. <laughs> um. So, Dan, you feel an overwhelming feeling in your head, and you are now, you, 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 you just fall to the floor, and it feels like you have no control in your I body. I said for Gillen the Thriller, salmon. <laughs> salmon. You feel like salmon. Luckily, I was, luckily I was already prone, so you I just still... stayed prone <laughs> You went, you got up, didn't you? No, I, 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 I bombed the guy. I that guy's head in, and then I got will attacked. Right. <laughs> <laughs> um, and y you feel like you have no control, but you are still conscious. Also, like you on can the still floor. look around, but it's fe uh, is, feels is like my mouth work. Yes. All right, good. I don't want to choke on my tongue. <laughs> yes. Still <laughs> breathe. Right. I like, I'm gonna go. so this is you can still incredibly unpleasant. Stuff, but you can't move your arms, your legs, and you can just kind of laying there on the floor. And kind of, you can't get up. It's it's like it's like your hands are tied to the ground. Okay. And your feet. Sir, I appear to have fallen and I can't get up. And I uh, punch him. <laughs> Wait, me? Uh, and Thomas yet. gets. Uh, Thomas get uh, goes to punch him, but uh, it, uh, as he tries, his, uh, his fist just kind of flies back to the elevator uh, wall. And it's it just kind of punch him. him. It's like he was supposed. He imagine like he's trying to punch him, and as he's about to hit, it just stops and just swooshes back, as if it was like a magnetic on on the wall. The elevator breaks. We all fall to our dooms. Um, the the window makes a little crack. A little and, one. Come on. We roll damage it, on that window. No. And you. Oh come on! I will. Your four hand three. is now stuck to 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 the wall. Okay, I attempt to punch with my other hand. That hand is also now stuck to the wall. What the fuck? <laughs> Quick, we're gonna distract him. Uh, this statement is false. He looks at you and he goes, "Well, if you are the bounty hunter, then I do hope the tales are true." Well, you'll see just how true they are. Uh, I'm going to make a will attack against him with the dazzle. Sure. In fact, no, I'm going to use mind fear. What? Oh, shit. Yeah, I can do mind fear. Get my fucking level, scrub. Yeah, let's make the guy who's inside both of our heads scared for his life. Great. Yeah, exactly. Well, it's either a mind meld, and I don't really want to gather information from him so much as I want him to be so fucking scared. In fact, wait a second. Uh, let's see here. I can do mind fear, mind transfer, or mind charm. Charm. Charm is just do... like, ooh, lovely. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I want to make give him an attraction to me. <laughs> Would have been a much easier way to do this. Shut up. I realize that now. <laughs> God damn it. Thanks, Mr. Helping not helping in the corner. Well, at least I'm not mind fucked like I knew you guys would be. Shut up! Okay, so, mind. <laughs> no, I'm gonna go with fear. Fear is more fun. We're gonna freak this guy's shit out. Uh, that's 18 plus. I don't know what it's plus. Uh, charisma, I think? Yes, charisma. So, 18 plus. Two. 
And what's the uh, difficulty DC? Uh, the DC is... I have no fucking idea. Oh, it's... it's <laughs> you must make a will save DC 10 plus charisma. Hmm. Wait, that means that you're not actually making... Oh, you're making a touch attack first, yeah. Yeah, I made the attack. I made, well, it's not even touch. I think it's just an attack. No, it's a touch attack. Oh, it is Because you need attack. to, like, have physical contact. So, um, so you basically try and mind fear him by putting, or, or you, yeah, never mind. You're not trying to touch attack. You're on yeah. the floor, man. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, I just realized, oh, well, I actually can't touch him. You can, you can touch his ankles. <laughs> no, he can't move his arms. No, I can't move. I call him a bunch of dirty names. No, I guess I can only use my my only from the ground prone thing and mind punch him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's just an attack. Uh, it's just not gonna hit him. It is not gonna hit him. <laughs> How much? I've used my, I've used up my. It's that's a seventeen. It's not gonna be enough to break that guy. Seventeen what? Actually, that's a good question. Is it if it's against AC then? Maybe I don't know. I don't know if far punch hits AC or it's I, pretty much AC. It's probably a touch attack, range touch. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, all right, yeah. So I guess so, it's range touch. So yeah, it totally hits him. You hit him square across the face. Deal. Uh, do some damage. <laughs> oh, this dice likes to roll fives. I have double chances to roll a three when I roll a d6. That's what I like to think of it as, as opposed to double chances to roll less than three. Uh, so that's five damage. Five damage. You just hit him square in the face, and he just goes like... Ugh. Well. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ha-ha. <laughs> <laughs> I really, uh, really name. wish I brought a gun. <laughs> <laughs> I... Uh... He laughs and he says, I don't think a gun would help you more than your biotic powers. That's just what you know. So it was a really nice gun. He walks up to you, Dan, and looks down on you and he says, So, even if you are the bounty hunter or not, why are you here? Your Omnitor. There's information on it and we need it. My Omni tool. Yep. Mm. And you see, the options weren't really great for getting it from you. And I don't know, I guess we kind of assumed you still wanted your arm to be on your body. In fact, arms can be replaced, but the information on my Omni tool cannot. Yeah, see, that was the general idea. I'm just going to copy it. How about Lonesies? Make a will check. You're gonna die. Um, <laughs> Your lungs stop doing lung things. What uh, weapons 15. did the guys on the floor have? Just spears. Just spears. It's like a, it's like a halberd kind Fucking of thing. Faggot. They don't appear to be like shock halberds or anything. No, it's just normal halberds. But there seems to be like pistols on 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 the on like the holsters of their. Like hidden by by their like very elegant clothes. They don't. Like... They don't have shock batons. No, that's unfortunate. <laughs> Is the booze covered handgun still in my belly? Did you bring it? I put it in my belly some time ago. Then yes. Yeah. Quick, put it in my mouth. It's the only thing they could fire, and it tastes like booze. <laughs> well, I can't you move make my hands. Sick. Yeah, I did. It's it's fifteen. Fifteen. Okay. Yeah. You feel like he's trying to enter a mind. He is not succeeding completely, but he f you can feel his power is starting to really, like, direct towards you. Oh, awesome. Now that he's touching my brain, can I do my mind thingies? Mm, you can, like, want to connect with him? Well, like, the, the, the um, SRE ability? Yeah, yeah. Uh, do I literally... You can try. Okay, you can cool. try that. All right, great. I am now going to try Mind Fear. Okay. Uh, sixteen plus charisma is an eighteen. 
Ce n'est pas... Um, he stands there and he seems to have taken like a hit, but he keeps going. Does he look terribly distracted? He's staring at at Dan right now. So yes. <laughs> if I had the capacity to do anything but try and protect my own brain, I'd say, "Quick, he's very in distracted." Fact, in fact, um, Dan's um, can I own charcoal? In fact, Dan's uh, attempt to uh, mind fear him kind of um, uh, makes him very confused and looks away for a bit. Am I free to punch things now? No. Um, well actually, save. never mind. Make, 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 make a strength check. I, I mean, that would be a well save, because he's doing that with his mind, but whatever. Make a strength check. Dude, you well, want the strength. I know. 17 plus 3. Guys. You... It, it, it's, it's... Imagine that you're literally, like, fighting against magnetism right now. Like, you're, like, slowly, like, getting your arms from the wall. It stalls magnets in an elevator! They're not magnets, they're behind I know. powers. I know. <laughs> but, um, and after a bit, you can feel like you cut loose. Like, it's like chains. You were bound loose. there for Then chains. I quickly attempt to punch him. You can do that. Hey, Mr. Hyde's in the fucking corner. Do you want to give him a hand? 17 plus 8. I've literally rolled 17 like three times in a row. Uh -huh. Dude, I'm the king of 16 at the moment. Yeah, sweet. Deal I damage. Thought... Oh, deal damage. Okay. That is 6 plus 8. Well, 8 plus 6. If you want to be specific. 14. Okay, you hit him square in the face. Yeah. He falls down prone. He's still on, he's still conscious. Dan is now free. Ah, thank God! I really needed to pee, and I don't know if I would be able to hold it in. Otherwise, if you had control of my body. Shut up! Punch him. Okay, yeah, I. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I don't he's even. He's still like, conscious, get... but you can but you can see that his uh, his his mouth is like a little bit open. His eyes are like barely open, and he's like. Ugh. I don't even get all the way up, I just get onto my knees and then on top of him and start trying to slug him. Slug him? <laughs> Punch him. Real hard in the face. <laughs> Not face, sorry, temple. Don't punch him in the okay. temple, Jesus Christ. I'm just gonna rock his fucking temple. Make damage check. <laughs> gonna rock him like a hurricane. Oh, is this straight damage? Mm -hmm. It's not much, it's uh... Unless I roll a six, I guess that's uh, three plus strength, so that's five. <laughs> Shit! Knock him in the head. You can see blood. All right, now quickly scan his fucking arm. Is he unconscious? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> I will scan his arm. You can see an omni tool. Uh, are there are there cameras in here first? Actually. Um, you don't know. Can I scan the vicinity and check? We don't have time. Scan his yes. fucking arm. <laughs> there are cameras in here. You can just scan it and scan if there are hidden cameras in there. Are there hidden cameras in here? Make a search check. Oh god! Really high. I rolled seventy. Okay, there is indeed two cameras on either side of the ele elevator. Okay, I'll I'll <laughs> without moving first. Like, do, do I have to stand up to check, or can I just scan, like, while I'm on the floor? <laughs> like, beep, 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 boop, boop. <laughs> Where you're knelt down like a worse. Like yeah. A just just in the corner, like, can I just scan God and check if there are things? damn it, Greg. <laughs> scan one. Like, he's like... He's scanning cameras, but he's not, like, he, he wants to, he, if, if that's the he case. Did like, just scan it. Yeah, 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 but, like, uh, do I have to get up and move, no. or can I... Right, so I can just sit on my ass. So I'm gonna gesture to the cameras, like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. No. Okay. Break them. <laughs> yeah. Make no. A I... yeah. You can make a disable device with your. Just girl. break them yeah, with your fist, Thomas. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I can do that. <laughs> we, got a, we got a tall guest guy. Fucking okay. Cameras Tom out. Thomas okay. goes over and smashes them. Excellent. Now they're smashed, I'll stand up and do my job. Excellent. I am covert operative. Yeah. Excellent. Okay, great. Thanks, buddy. I did good. 30. 
computer use, 30. Uh, for hacking his computer, I suppose? Yes. Can, you can see there's a lot of com uh, a lot of information that is uh, de um, like encrypted. Like a lot. Oh. En encrypted, yes. Like the, the, you can't make make out what any of it means, but it's obviously some sort of. Can I just copy the whole load? We can decrypt it later. It will later. take time. That's fine. We're in a stuck elevator. How long? How long is time? Um, you don't see a loading bar. <laughs> well, just, I can estimate, right? I know computers. How long will it take me to... About, like, 20 minutes. About. 20 minutes. That's a yeah. long time. Okay, he said arms are replaceable. Computers by the elevator. He um, did say arms are replaceable. <laughs> um, you can see on the elevator, um, you can hear a voice. It's like every... Uh, the elevator is stopped. Is everything all right in there? Uh, oh god, I'm gonna hand some of this. Uh, yeah, there was just a leak in the reactor core. Everything's fine now. <laughs> no, I go, uh, yeah, everything's fine. Why wouldn't it be? Like, I just sound confused. Bluff check! That's uh, 18 plus 10 is 28. Uh, 18 plus 28. 18 plus no. 10 is 28. <laughs> but yeah, 18 plus 28. Those guys quit their job. <laughs> yeah, just go like, what am I doing with my life? <laughs> Yeah, I like hearing my so. You want to go home and rethink your life. <laughs> I want oh to go God, home and rethink my life. Do I just do I just learn force persuasion? Am I, do I become a Jedi? You're I don't not. want to sell my death sticks. Sell my, you're not a tele telepath. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not a Jedi. Damn. No, you could be a Jedi with the with the other uh, the biotic class. You chose now you're a poorly. I chose no. Sith. I chose the cool one. Guys, let's let's rip off his arm. No, that's not. Um, no, no, he's got he's got he time now. But it's he responds. All right, but um, we're we're gonna get the elevator working in a bit, so just hang out there. Sure thing. Um, I heard that there might be some mess going on with the guests upstairs. You might want to try and send someone to look into that. Uh, yes, but the your the elevator you're in is the only way up, so we're we're working on that right now. Okay, then not a problem. We will uh, be sending guards over. Uh, uh, Excellent. Not a problem at all. Then I just stopped responding to the microphone thing, and I, you know, like, I guess there was a button I was holding. I don't hold that button anymore. And then I'm going to start trying to break the window out. <laughs> <laughs> Let me do it. Great. Fantastic news. Boot. 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 Guys, I just crit the window. window. You just crit the window. I just crit the window. You crit the window. The window breaks. <laughs> Doesn't make any noise. Yes. Of course it does, but you're like really high up. You're in, in the middle of a fucking like you're on the side. The elevator is on the side of of, of this fucking uh, tower. Okay. So, like, so guys, how do you feel about climbing? I feel extremely competent. It's about, how uh, high is really high? A hundred and two hundred meters up. You are meters middle or feet? Mm -hmm. Can we Meet. have it in feet, please? Because that's. How the game Life works. Life increments is how we do distance in the game. Okay, right? let's say. Okay, let's d dumb it down a bit. Let's say like three hundred feet up. That's pretty high. Have you got? How could that? Have you had a grapple? Two hundred foot. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Okay. Yes, I brought the grappling hook up of an incredibly tall building. I figured this might be the case. <laughs> okay, great. Um, it... Well, I mean, that would help us get down some of the way, but then I look at the rest of our sort of. Uh, Wait, Rona, did you, did, the did you just here, say anyway. dumb it down? Yeah, um, 200 and 400 meters is way much, way much more than 300 feet. It's true, it is. Yeah. Yeah. 300 feet is like 300 feet, 2 the, meters. It's like 2.5 feet to a meter, basically. 91 meters, this does. Yeah, it's, um, oh, it's good. It's good. Yep. Fantastic. <laughs> Huh. Okay. Right. So. So I look out and go. I. I mean, we broke the window. No one can say that we did you it. You can see that there's information in the Omni tool. <laughs> I mean. And you. And you are now loaded, but uh, downloading it. Basically, you're copying it. All I, right. So while you're copying, I'm gonna climb out and get on top of it. I can just make the elevator work again when we're done. Yeah. No, that's true. It's I'm not gonna, a problem. I'm, I'm, we I'm can go further down. 
We can go further down, that's right. Is there a manual way to just sort of lower it down slowly, like just begin the motion? Oh, and manual also... Way. Like, we... as in, is there a lock, like a lever on, on top of the lift? Um. Well, like, it was just the emergency stop, right? So yeah, it's probably just an emergency brake on top of the lift, yeah. essentially. So, so yeah, yes. I I'm can gonna, just I'm gonna, undo I'm gonna that. Start, I'm you, can see, you can see on the panel inside that there is actually a button that releases. Hmm. Yeah, we don't want to keep mashing the alarm button though, do we? No, but the other there's another one that, that releases the brake. Uh, well, that's what I mean, it's like, I, I don't want it to go down too fast because we need to kill 20 minutes, so I want to undo and keep redoing the brake up from up top instead of continuing to mash the alarm and off, alarm right. and off, alarm and off. So I'm just going to start, you know, working it way down. My hand makes the familiar jacking motion necessary to lift. Take a balance tick. Oh. Okay. Rip. No, uh, 12 though. It's not great, but presumably I won't die. You slip. Shit. You land on the <laughs> elevator, however, so you don't actually fall down. Okay, yeah. alright. I've changed my mind. I don't want to do that anymore. Let's just keep mashing the alarm key. <laughs> it well, will look you really just weird. don't need to. Like, just... You're just gonna, we're just going to leave it at the full 20? Just leave it here, and you then... See, see, the thing is, you don't push the alarm button. You push another button to will release the brake. It doesn't make another alarm. Yeah, no, but what I want to do is then re-brake it, like continue ah, to keep putting the brakes back on again, so that we're going down slower. So, can... so basically, so it gives us time to kill the full 20 minutes, as opposed to then just turn the brake off, and then we arrive at the bottom <laughs> with guards shooting us in the face. Well, like, we can turn it back on. <laughs> All right. And then uh, press the emergency like, stop Like, if button. nothing else, here, take this spear and jam it in the thing. Smart man. Okay. Uh, I mean, I take a spear anyway because it's always useful to have a spear. I offer one of the others a spear. There are two spears after all. Yes. Thomas already has murder fists, so he doesn't need a spear. Who do you what, hand? The what spear is to? the spear damage? That's a good question. Um, It'd be like a D8, like a D8. Probably a D8. Yeah. D20. Spear. <laughs> See, I told you this lift took for It's a 1d8. It's a 1d8. It's the um, same well, as your fist. Well, melee, punch... weapons, melee weapons don't deal a lot of damage. Because well, they, one, go through shields. Guys, it's and fine. Two, they're not very good. My, my, to, like, pure damage. my fist has guaranteed 6 plus damage on that 8. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no, that's why I don't give you the other spear. Uh, I passed the spear to Reina. 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 Okay. Yeah. I ask how they're feeling. How are you doing? Uh, and don't say I never take you anywhere nice. This is exciting, right? <laughs> uh, Errol's like, we're gonna die up here, aren't we? No, this uh, is fine. Reina's like, well this, ex well, this is kind of exciting. It's kind of probably gonna end up us dying at some one point, don't you think? See, nah. what you fail to realize is that strictly speaking, we did nothing wrong. Uh, it was these two, so we'll send them out the elevator, they'll bring the elevator down, and then we'll tell them what happened. Huh? My plan was just to what stop before say? we reached the bot. It like, it like us to just get out of the elevator. No, my plan was, now it's changed. I say that when, just before we hit the bottom and the doors open, we just hit the alarm like just before the doors are supposed to open and then just jump out the broken yeah, back window and cheese it. They don't need to do that. Yeah, no, they can, they, can leave, they can leave normally. I'm saying that me, me and Thomas, we're going to cheese it. I mean, I could climb down right now. I have amazing climb. It would also take you so long to get down there because of the distance that the, the lift will get fixed and crush you. We have 20 minutes, come on. It's now 10 minutes. Yeah, would you like to Would you like to risk the climb check as opposed to just wait until we're a safe distance from the ground? We can't, you're not immune to rolling a one, sir. Mm. It, it's fine. <laughs> like, literally, patient. they'll fix the elevator. We'll let them think they fix the elevator. The elevator will come down. Uh, and then... You Before two we will, open out, we'll just jump you out this two broken can back get window the back, and cheese it. And us, the rest of us, can all stay in here and tell them what happened, which equates exactly to the security cameras. 
Dan, you said I'm not immune to rolling a one. So I did a random roll. Immediately yeah. rolled a one? Yeah. So I, I stay on the elevator. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You're welcome, because I just you, saved you. You tried to climb out the top and fell. No, no. <laughs> I, I literally just saved you from karma, didn't I? Yeah. You would have done that climb check and then died. <laughs> yeah. So okay. I, I patiently... Learn if I've to... saved a life, if nothing else. <laughs> And you might have also well, taken one. Right. Strictly well, speaking, okay, no. Time yeah. is oh, now wait, short. Was, that was me. Uh, the download is uh, very soon uh, complete. The lift. Like, just a matter of a minute. I, say, I just m mumble into the intercom. Come on, are you going to take any longer in there? Uh, there's no answer. Uh, all you hear is... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all I hear is... <laughs> <laughs> Someone learning a shotgun. Uh, I oh I, uh ooh ooh, does the guy still have the chip? Um, the spare you can one? search him for it. You guys search him. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't touching him. <laughs> uh yeah, I do a search check. So do I. I get fifteen. Fifteen and. Let me see. Also. Already higher. Nineteen. In total. Okay. You definitely find the chip in his pocket. Oh, oh, shit. It's very small. It's <laughs> I watched Thomas lift out and go, oh. <laughs> Looks like it's very delicate. It's very uh, small. Uh, has anyone got like a handkerchief? Something that <laughs> to carry? You mean some kind of thing for carrying small electronic parts? Yes, here. Which one of these boxes would you like? <laughs> I just I just give it to Craig. Like <laughs> No, no, no. no he doesn't want take to one of the boxes. <laughs> I take one of the boxes for him. I put it in. Okay. And I guess I can just hand Thomas back the box and tell him to keep it safe. I put that it sounds in like his... insanity, but he's the biggest guy and he's got a stomach. I put it in my, like, belly. Behind yeah. my chassis. I think <laughs> I can do that. Yeah. I'm... What, could, what could possibly stop you? And if you can't now, I'll install a compartment later. <laughs> right. Um, yours. Uh, the elevator now starts to move its way down. Can it's very ask. quick. Awesome. The wind. The wind is like whoo, because the, the window is well, open. It would really down. Oh, is that? is the okay. download complete? Yes. Good. Okay. Cool. Uh, I shall. Out the window. I shall return to cowering in the corner. Thomas jumps out through the window. Yeah. yeah, he falls and dies. <laughs> yeah, no, I just, I just, I assume you mean when we're like a safe distance from the ground. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, when it's we're twenty, when we're, when we're, it's still pretty high up. Yeah, no. Uh, when we're like twenty or so feet away from the ground, I just hit the alarm key and then I, I go, my lady, it's been a pleasure, and you know, do the fancy gentleman thing. Uh, get, you, you know, know you're a lady. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, I was pl I was playing the role. I was I, I had the man role, you know. Like I had the I had the yeah. overarm, and she had the underarm. I give her the 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 palm hand up. Yeah, it was a pleasure, my lady. And then I just fucking leap out the back. Ladies, best bluff places. <laughs> I should return to cowering in the corner. <laughs> I go beatboxing. Greg is very happy. Did, you, just, did you just tell the quarians to do their best bluff face? <laughs> Correct. That's exactly what I did. Whatever. All right. Jump check. Uh, 26. <laughs> I think I'm 26. fine. And Thomas. Uh, 13 plus jump, right? Mm hmm. 13 plus 11. 24. You have, you have to take armor penalty into. Uh, so, also, uh, jump uh, jump penalties are. Um, are uh, double, double your uh, armor penalty, I'm pretty sure. Nope. That's fine. Right, right, now, right now, right now, I'm completely unarmed myself, so I'm. Fine. Um. It, yeah. I'm. Is Thomas, Thomas wearing his armor? I don't know. Thomas. I guess. Yeah. He was there as bodyguard. Um. It's minus two, Thomas. Minus two. two. So that's twenty-two. All right. That's pretty fucking good. Still. Yeah. He's really good at jumping. Um. He jumps down, or you guys jump down. He's laying at the street. And there's doesn't seem to be anyone there at the moment. I looked at Thomas and go, "Run! <laughs> Fly, you fools! Fly, you fools! Ship!" Yeah, no. And I just fucking I I I ship it down back to our uh, hotel. Oh, I right. thought we were running for the ship. No, we got I stuck mean, too quickly. 
Okay. Right. Um. Maybe, maybe I left all my gear. The though. elevator reaches its destination, and uh, and uh, Rena now feels a little bit uncomfortable. It's like, uh, so what is my role now? Um, um she, we tell she, them what happened. No, no, she, 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 <laughs> she, you now have two corneas in both of your hands, and you're just like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> somewhere, somewhere back at the hotel room, I'm going. That son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> this was my plan all along. <laughs> yeah, hide in the corner like a coward, and suddenly Turian sandwich. <laughs> um, that bastard. <laughs> and then you get down, and there are five seasick um, Turians. I took out uh, all the parts <laughs> as I. As um, as the door opens, I will make an active show of standing up and composing myself. Acting up and what? Like uh, I'm, I'm gonna stand up, like from oh, the corner. Oh shit! I mean, I'm not being a coward. <laughs> brush myself down and gentlemen, <laughs> <laughs> gentlemen, <laughs> and they raise their rifles and they're like, uh. and it's just like, and then. And, and, they don't. They stop aiming at you, and they like lower their weapons. And it's like, oh, my, holy hell! What happened here? Uh, there was a quarry and a gaff, and they knocked out the guards and jumped out the window. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm to sorry. Mm -hmm. uh, sorry. Sorry. Many attractive quarry and ladies around. Very confused. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. They jumped out the window. Um, as you may notice from the broken window. I don't know why. So, just focusing on the unconscious, incredibly rich old man by your feet. Yeah, they walk up to him and go like, "Oh my god, this is terrible!" And it's like, uh, "There's cars in the background, so, this stuff so is swooshing up." <laughs> and uh, so. and uh. Yeah, it just becomes like a crime scene, and uh, you're being questioned. I will uh, tell them uh, an the officer truth. Go, goes up and says, "So, um, you were in the elevator when this happened, yes? Correct. Uh, and uh, what happened exactly? What can you tell me?" As I told the other guy, uh, there was an Asari and a Geth, and for some reason, they attacked the guards, and then the guy did some biotic thing, and then they beat him up, and then they she had, like notes, notes punched on, on her on the, the walls. I think maybe there were cameras or something. Um, and then they waited and then jumped out the window. I don't really know what they were doing. They were probably on drugs. <laughs> I bet it was um, drugs. They didn't How do does a cat get on drugs? They, um, no, no, they didn't do anything though. to you, people? Oh, no. Ah. But they did take something from him. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ah, he was demonstrating some chip. They probably took that. That's probably what they took. Okay. <laughs> None of this is bluffing, though. Yeah, no, it's so actually good. all yeah. the truth, which is <laughs> great. <laughs> Smart move, really. Telling the truth, you sneaky bastard. I don't have to make rolls. <laughs> Right, and uh, she turns off her omni tool. It's like, thank you for the information. Um, uh, we, you will be escorted out of this uh, area now. It just needs to be C sec only now. If Understandable. You thank you. Yes. So you're being escorted out, and uh, yeah. I will, I will make sure to see that the lovely ladies are well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're just following you. They're just like. Why did you tell him that? Plausible deniability. If I tell them the truth, I'm not lying. <laughs> <laughs> You're an asshole! And Errol goes, throw us under the bus! And Errol just goes like... And? What? They're gonna point. find out there was cameras. Why do you think I hid in the corner? They didn't know I had any part to do with this. But they're gonna get them! We thought no, we... they're not. 
Do you not realise they're already investigating all of us? They are clearly incompetent because the guy that was part of that thing that they were investigating just walked past them. They know nothing. They're idiots. They can't track down a fucking dog if it had a chip in it. You might go run over by a bus. Oh, sad now. See, see, they both take like a deep breath and they go, <sighs> All right, let's just leave this place, please. They, retor they return to the hotel, and me and Dan are just sitting there drinking. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm, 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 in fact, as they arrive, I've like I've geared myself back up again. You know, I've neatly folded up my suit because it was a nice suit. Um, Evening. Yeah, get into the hotel. And, yeah. I'm just so I'm just sort of sat at the side of the bed, looking at my hands, because I'm like, oh man, what if I am the bouncy hunter? <laughs> no, no, it, I'm looking at everyone. You thinking, can hear thinking, large footsteps outside your apartment. Uh, hey, Gronk. Oh, oh, the <laughs> and the door slams open, and it's Gronk, and he's like, Where have you guys been? At the party. Oh, oh told shit. You. Uh, hey, Gronk, so got into some trouble with the law. Might need to leave soon. But we just got here. This is like the best place for women. <laughs> Have you gotten lucky, Grunk? Well, not yet. I just got here. Oh, okay. God. I've heard I go, you know what? Actually, I don't think I've ever heard a better idea for disguise. Uh, I make sure my tux is all folded away. I've got my weapons and shit. Let's just leave those guys a note and go to a real sleazy drinky bar. Let's go. Well, not sleazy. We'll just go to the loosest leave one in the note. fancy place. Yeah, like basically saying, we've gone to go to the bar. Right. <laughs> Uh, see you at the I ship. Don't want... See, I uh, said so basically, you know, see you at the ship in a couple hours. Right, we don't want to be so... in the hotel room when they arrive because if right, they arrive so with like armed to... guards, then we're fucked. Right. So, are you going to like the hotel bar, or are you going like somewhere else? Somewhere else. Well, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna try and get some distance away because right. yeah, those guys so are you're being, going like, like a couple of uh, like uh, just a block or two down. Up, yeah, some blocks away. Yeah. Still, still all, uh, still fancy because it's still the Presidium. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you go in there and you see a lot of classy people. You get a sort of a deja vu feeling. <laughs> God, I don't want to kill everyone in here. Just, uh... <laughs> you just got kind of like, huh? This is. Familiar. I like look at Thomas and like, do you feel weird at all? <laughs> Thomas murder, is like, murder, murder, murder. No, Define, bad. <laughs> Define deja vu. Do not compute. Right. All right, so you walk in and whatever. Grunk yeah, is with yeah. you. The Corians are with you. No, everyone, is just there. You sit down by the bar. And well, they, I, I thought like they were leaving before. Yeah, yeah. Basically, we wanted to leave before anyone else arrived, just in case they got escorted by C-Sec back to the hotel, which would be a yeah. terrible idea if they then saw us. So we did leave ahead of them. We left uh, ahead of. Oh, yes. and the they did not get esco escorted to the hotel. They got escorted out of the uh, crime scene. Yeah. Well, we didn't know that, so we're yeah. in a, ah, we're okay. at the bar so and we're we we playing safe. So we we, okay. we pick a we pick a nice big corner table though. And like, so oh, we Thomas were and Dan are now at the bar and. Uh, I play wingman. I am at the hotel alone with two lovely ladies. And Grunk. Damn it. <laughs> Grunk went no. with them. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he, oh Grunk yeah. Grunk. <laughs> um. <laughs> Yeah, no, we brought Grunk along. I'm playing wing lady for Grunk. Okay, so, um, yeah, you... I'm helping you, him. You, Somehow, I still managed to find at least one stripper. No, there's no strippers there. Well... <laughs> no, look at one guy. Didn't she used to be a stripper? <laughs> she used to be a stripper. She, she, she very... <laughs> slaps me. Damn it. <laughs> she goes like, ah. Oh. <laughs> she blushes. I have had a dark past. No, she's not more. She's not that. Yeah, you will run away. <laughs> she goes like, ah, how dare you and stuff like that. So, uh, this is very up class people. Yeah, and no, stuff like that. yeah so, no, I, I just, I just help introduce Grunk to the ladies. <laughs> well, Do I need to make a roll for that shit? <laughs> I no, know. I need you to role play that shit. Okay, uh, oh. I basically just settle up to the bar and go, why hello there, we've just rolled in from space. We're roguish mercenary types. I don't know, you might yeah. not find it very interesting, though. Uh, it's, 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 she turns uh, her face around. You can see... It's a man. <laughs> it's Aphio. 
Oh, God, Jesus I got, I got, you have got to be fucking good. <laughs> <laughs> Zen's is, you can see his, like, piercing eyes. Uh, I look, I look, I look, look at Zen's eyes. Like, he's just like... Is, I'm getting, I'm getting punked, right? This is a setup. <laughs> Are we punked? Zen's is just like... Really now, the third time. I go, no, you, know, you guys, this isn't funny, okay? I don't believe in coincidences. <laughs> I point so, my gun at them. This is fucking bullshit. <laughs> so, if you goes, so... Um, how did that go? Uh, uh, you know what? It's quite good. Did you know that that guy isn't really good against a punch in the face? You knocked him out? Uh, Minor concussion. Slightly. Fine. Slightly. I left him a med to jail, that's cool. You didn't. Shut up. <laughs> no, <okay. laughs> no, I go, like, no, he's fine. I made sure he was still breathing and alive and okay. He'll be fine, just a bit of a you headache. You didn't. Shut up, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Funny, because you didn't. Shut up! <laughs> I didn't know that! That's fine, I'm not there. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking bluff jack. 23, yeah, I did. <laughs> he didn't. <laughs> well, they're not, they're not going to believe you over me. Your charisma's too low. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I look at them and go, why are you guys here? Um. Uh, Aphio just, get, just uh, looks down at the bar again, takes a drink, and goes, well, I figured you were going to get here. Um, it was How? pretty easy to follow you. Yeah, I guess it was, and I suppose it's no small feat to find me in a bar. Uh, you would be surprised, yeah. Uh, yeah especially okay. that Krogan of yours is pretty easy to follow hey, in the crowd. Hey, Grunk is a great, he's, he's a good dude. Also, I think he thinks you're very pretty. Xantas looks over and goes like, Really? Fourth time? Oh. <laughs> and... and and a few giggles a bit, but just just like, all right. Can you please stop making hits on me? He hey, no, I was doing that for my Grunk. Husband. I was doing that for Grunk, though. He thinks you're both attractive. No, I don't. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> I think you're both attractive. Grunk only likes the lady. Mm, that's right. Yeah, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah, that's right. Boobies and stuff. <laughs> that's me, Grunk. Ha ha ha. Totally not compensating. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not homophobic. I'm not homophobic. <laughs> and I go, fine, I find you both attractive. I wink at them. <laughs> yeah, soon I'm gonna contemplate shooting you. I know. She says. You have done that. <laughs> oh, she I says. I, I, I say, Ooh, like, the last thing, the last thing I want you guys it. to do is to warm up to me. Heaven forbid. You guys have um, done that. You have considered shooting him three times. Um, no, he no, had a couple go. Only three. The no, sure not wanted one to shoot. Wants wants to shoot uh, Dan so much. Yeah, I know. I look at him and go, "Look, I just want to make sure that you guys don't ever like me. I have. I'm afraid that my roguish charm would rub off on you." <laughs> I, as I say that, I'm like very clearly fucking kidding. <laughs> I don't want to get shot. <laughs> you get shot. <laughs> <laughs> You die of boy. Xantus just kind of kind of gets, rolls his eyes and he he leans on on the bar and goes, "Whenever you say, I'll shoot him or her." In that case, yes. and, and if you just goes, "Whenever I say, I just pats him." <laughs> it's gonna be the fucking honeymoon is hunting me down, bloodsport style. I mean, I think they already had their. Honeymoon. Is it gonna be like a sorry hard target? That's what's up. <laughs> I'm gonna find my crazy, crazy Cajun uncle. <laughs> right, so Atheo says, um, so you do know that the only reason I haven't tracked you down and killed you already is for a specific reason. You do know that he's my father. Yeah, and he's alive. Mm -hmm. I would think that's a very good reason to kill us. <laughs> what, leaving him alive? Don't be an asshole, Theo, okay? Punching him in the face really hard. He's alive. It's more than could be said for other situations. I heard his nose crack. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> I, sir, help me, I will reboot you. Um, Please no. She says, Well, you certainly have potential of being the one that 
bounty hunter has met before. I think. Can you tell me about this person? Because I really don't know that much. As you, you can know. see, gigantic holds my memory. Um. Jesus, uh, Santa said that no one knows about the bounty hunter. Damn it, you guys keep saying that, but I keep hoping that there's some little sliver of information you're just not giving me. See, he he turns for you. It's like he's serious this time. Uh, like he's not like angry or anything. He just turns to you, very genuine. It's like, look, the bounty hunter is no one and anyone. He's never shown himself, and for the ones he's shown him, he's he has he hasn't even shown his false identity. His helmet. His his. Uh, we don't even know how he looks like because everyone he shows himself to it's dead oh the okay that you have seen even himself I, it, I put her hand up and go maybe herself and then I lean back on the bar and go I wonder if we fucked <laughs> <laughs> like I, I know, as a genuine curiosity it's like that could have happened considering your track record very maybe, likely maybe I, I look up he, and go maybe we had a thing maybe he that's it he, he just kind of closes his eyes and goes like you don't want anything could happen. I don't know, but yeah, no. Like I literally, I'm, I'm like, I'm like considering the fact. It's like maybe we had a thing. Maybe that's why I'm still here and alive. I mean, maybe we did. My life then. You know what? He, and he says, you know, the only, you know, this is one of the few times when I can actually say that's possible. Because bounty hunter, we know nothing about. And the Ooh. fact that you met him, or her, or her, whatever. Yeah, you can't keep assuming the bounty hunters are male. I mean, that's just not cool. Whatever. He's like, it's just like he just pulls his hands up. It's like whatever. Yeah, no. It's like I, I, I like, I look very firm about that. I'm an equal opportunities flirter slash murderer slash <laughs> slasher. <laughs> You're an equal opportunities slasher. No. <laughs> I'm an equal, no, yeah, I'm an equal, feel, yeah, I'm an equal opportunity flirter slash murderer slash slasher. If you turns to Dan and says, um, so I feel like you're ready to hear, uh, to hear this now. We Jeez. actually work for the bounty hunter. Fucking damn it. <sighs> the fact that you've seen him is confusing. Because it does not only worry us, but it also int intrigues us. Okay. Um. Great. <laughs> I like. I I'm just trying to take all that shit on board. Like, are we specters? We're specters, right? Nailing <laughs> it. And <laughs> and Santa's <Sanchez> goes. <laughs> no, you could be fucking specters, and if you just just kind of like not just like. Just looks at him. It's like, yeah, fine. <laughs> Actually, they they kind of good. <laughs> kinda really fucking good. <laughs> like uh, I, look, I look at go. The bounty hunter definitely could. <laughs> mm, maybe I could. Um, um we Santa could. Says, if uh, well, Santa, <laughs> Santa says that you had an amnesia, we want to find and. The fact that you've uh, met the bounty hunter may lead to something about the mad bounty hunter. And the bounty hunter probably has something way bigger to tell us. He's probably planning all of this to happen. And we want to know what he's planning. Like, mm. why, would, why would he give uh, uh, such a, a spy mission to just anyone? That's not, that's, that's not how he'd do it. He wanted to test you. Maybe I was just that charming. And besides, like that's the good. That quiet the chest squeak. And besides, and he said he just ignores it and goes. Besides, the, the fact that he let your your uh, companions actually go with you leads me to believe that there's something also connected there. Hey, they're just cool. Yay. Swag. No. Also, I mean, I do it for the companionship points as well. <laughs> Um, exactly. <laughs> um, I'm busy selling you out, and you're like bigging me up. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I would have done the same in your position. <laughs> yeah, but you're a bluff. Yeah. 
it. You could have lied about it. <laughs> I couldn't. I might not have lied. <laughs> it doesn't mean I don't respect being easy. <laughs> um. Yeah, if you're just goes, um. Yeah, we don't really know what we're, what, where to go after this, at this point. But well, I say that well, we're going to look through a bit of information. We're going to take a bit of a peek. I'm not going to look through all of it because I don't really want us to get annihilated for any mysterious reasons or go missing. And then we're going to pass on to the bounty hunter and see where it takes us. Mm, fair enough. Did you say why you needed he needed it? No, but I'm hoping that when we take a look, we'll find out. He needed it because he smuggled us onto the citadel. Well, no, he needed it, but he smuggled us. I wanted to be smuggled onto the citadel because I wanted to look into some stuff that, that bore no fruit. But then we got into this party in it. Turns out that I had a lot more information than expected. And then I look at the two again. Lots more. Strange coincidences. That kind of thing. You know. Swag. <laughs> Strange coincidences. Yeah. What a bunch of weird, mysterious coincidences. It's like when someone asks the hero, You! How did you get here? And you're like, Oh, I don't know. Some clever planning by our DM. <laughs> 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 A lot of posh and circumstance that really it was quite unlikely, but you know, it's a story. <laughs> it's quite a story. Yes. Um, also, it turns out Team Orphan Meat have renamed themselves the Mighty Morphin Meat Rangers. <laughs> wow. That's funny. Um, um, you sit there for a while and you talk with a few, and, and Santa's kind of like. <laughs> updating each other, like on, 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 on like what, what's been going on. Uh, like between the bounty hunter and stuff like that, it's just they're they're still very interested in like the, the the bounty hunter, but they seem still very surprised that he's actually been showing himself. Yeah, no, I um, I say that I've yet to get the bounty hunter to respond with smiley face emoticons, but I'll let them know if it happens. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's like next time it's like we did it, and you go, well done, winky face. Like I knew it, it's a woman. <laughs> 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 this means nothing. <laughs> it doesn't matter, um, I'm still going to flood with it. Right. It's a reaper. So, still. I, I, I cross... Uh, I cross... A bar, you're, you're looking out, you can see the... Uh, gr Grunk is like looking out the window. And he's just like looking out at like a huge like Krogan statue. What do you uh, I, I thought he's looking at fish. <laughs> what do your oven I see? <laughs> what do your Krogan I see? <laughs> They're taking the Volus to Isengard! <laughs> no! <laughs> They're taking the Volus to Citadel! Citadel! <laughs> wow. Um, does not simply tank Reaper into Mordor. Right, uh, he's looking out onto the statue and like in the middle of um, this little garden place. There's like fountains, there's water running. Not on this plat on this statue. Um, uh -oh. you, you can see the bounty hunter sitting on the fount uh, on the, on the head of the Krogan. How is this guy stealthy? He's just what? He's looking at you, Dan. I look at my hands again first, <laughs> just to check. Uh, they nor they're normal. I nod and I look up again. He's gone. Yeah, I okay. figured as much. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> And Guys. that will be the end of the session. <laughs> Very intriguing. Very intriguing. I feel like now the best opportunity is to throw those guys into a war zone because I did a lot of talky bullshit. And I feel bad that I took the reins a lot. <laughs> it was a lot of fun, don't get me wrong. But I feel bad that I took the reins so much. I punched I, the guy. You did punch I, tr the I tried to get the others into this as much as possible. I did talk to an Elcor. Yeah, that you did. <laughs> well, I'm a yeah, clever did... operative. I, like... Yeah, yeah, you did actually. That was it. Was smarter thinking to hide like a pussy than expected. So, how many level ups do we get? Is it three? I hope it's three more. Like strictly speaking, you failed mission parameters. I didn't. I did the whole mission. I no. got in there, undetected, took the data. Yeah, it's fine. I left. succeed vicariously through you. You're just <laughs> one of my tools. You're ablative. 
you <laughs> just allowed me to do this. Yeah, exactly. Without me, where would you be? I don't know, maybe hung over in a bar somewhere. Where did it go all, all go wrong? Why did I get arrested? <laughs> It'd be nothing without the web of lies of I've this... cautiously woven. <laughs> Out of this session, Thomas and Dan both received plus two reputation for uh, being uh, spotted on the cameras. Terrible criminal. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Five reputation. Yeah, up to five reputation. See, reputation is neither bad or good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's less, slightly less, good. Less, less reputation life. means you you won't be uh, recognizable as much. More just means people know who you are. Well, at least they'll believe me a little bit more when I go, I am Relnir, space badass! And they'll know that I got in a fight with the boss of the biotics. They'll go, Kill him! <laughs> criminal! <laughs> stop uh, right I'm there, stop, criminal I'm scum! Stop right there, you violate... Space badass. Stop right there, criminal scum. You violate the law. I am the law. <laughs> Raw. Exactly. Don't worry, I have Gronk. He's my can. He's my hand cannon for when I am the law. He's your can cannon. <laughs> Whatever. He's my ham cannon. He's your hack. He's your can my ham cannon. cannon. He's going ham. Exactly. <sighs> Broken's all ham as fuck. Mm. Alright, so then, I'm gonna, like, hop out of the cool and... Just, uh, just to, uh, close this up, uh, I'm actually, every, for every adventure you guys do, I actually make it chapter-wise, and I give it a chapter name. What about this one? Uh, the first, ep the first one was Blackout. The second was Shotgun Diplomacy. The third one was Shaken and Stirred. <laughs> I like all these so far. This is accurate. Right. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Yeah, I did. It was really Wait. fun, man. Now I need to retitle the YouTube videos. What was the first one? Blackout. 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 I don't think you re it's, recorded it's, it's, Blackout. It's not the sessions that are... Oh, no, I didn't. didn't. It's, it's, it's like entire adventures. Okay. So you don't... You shouldn't have to do that, but like... Okay. The episode. I'm kind of thinking the whole campaign as episodes. I'll just leave it as session one, sort of. Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. So, yeah. Yeah. When's the next one? No idea. Weekend? No. Unlikely. Maybe Sunday. Well, if Sunday's possible, otherwise, you guys free Monday or Tuesday? I'm free Sunday, Monday, blah, 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 blah. I'm free whenever. Unless there is a Dota match. Cool. Oh, yeah. That's that thing we do. Yeah. Basically, should... depends on whether I'm knackered. Because my plan for this weekend is go somewhere, get drunk, play D&D. Don't know what time I'll be going to bed. Don't know what time I'll be waking up. So. <laughs> it's, uh, it's tough to say whether I'll be coherent. On Sunday, right. in essence. In <sighs> any case, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Peace.